Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here. Welcome back to another Elden Ring playthrough stream. Hello everybody, hello. What's up Sleeper? Hello Gabriel, how goes it? R2D2, what's up man? Dylan, hello. Harry, hello. Daniel, hello. Red Robin, hello. Soulless Space and Feddy, hello. What's up guys? Hello, hello. One sec, there we go. All right, we are back from our continuation. We're at, what are we on? We're on day four five we're on day five yeah we're actually getting pretty far last night we made it to the capital city yeah the capital and then we went down into the sewers and we completed moog the forsaken that's what we did yes that was the last thing that we did so we still have a few things we can do we can either i guess we should complete the capital first i'm trying to remember where we didn't explore in the capital we have the boss we have the end boss for sure um, what is this? The Erd Tree Sanctuary, and this is the Queen's Bed Chamber. We have the Forsaken Depths. This is all the uh, sewer area for sure. This is the Capital Rampart. Where did that? Oh, that's how we got into the Capital. Okay. So let's just go look for the boss fight near the actual Capital entrance. Let's. What's the Erd Tree Sanctuary? Is that the close one? You're so lost after killing Godric. Yeah, you get a whole new area. Connor, you get you get access to Liurnia, the like water area. It's pretty huge. Okay, so this was the royal capital. We fought a boss here. What? I'm trying to figure out which one was closest to the boss fight. Let's try the queen's bed chamber. Hey, what's up, Ronnie? How goes your day, man? Ah, yes, the bed chamber. <laughs> Uh, well, I'm, I'm in the city, so it doesn't really show me the Guidance of Grace anymore, because the, the main area is basically here. Like, I've been there, I guess. Um, that leads to the boss fight. Okay, perfect. This is close, so now we can just finish off the little bit of the capital that we didn't do yet. Perfect. Bed chamber, and then this was the road leading up to it. I know there was a branch point at which I didn't go a certain direction. Hey, Matthew, thank you so much, man. I appreciate that. Um, did we, there was the dragon that we climbed. I didn't find the Wakizashi. Is that another type of katana? <laughs> I am ro rocking the moon veil. I'm actually going to make a video just on where to find the moon veil because I get asked that so much in the stream. So I'm going to do that eventually. Um, so yeah, I guess we've been here. This is the other grace point. Okay. Yeah, we did finish the never-ending sewers. We did. It led to a very cool-looking boss fight. Hold up. Can I parkour onto this roof? Oh, my God. I can. This is what I'm talking about. There's still a few things to explore in the city. So I want to do the boss last. Because I know after the boss, I'm just going to be like, all right, where's next? But I can parkour a little here. Wait, is this meant to be parkour? I don't know, man. Why is that roof there if not? You know? Well, guess not. That leads to the other grace point. This is how we got to the ball. We didn't go to the Colosseum either. Okay, I guess maybe all we have to do here is maybe the boss. Maybe we did, like, secure every area. It's possible. Let me just look down the elevator really quick. Oh, was there an open window? Okay, I'm going back up. Just, just looking. So that's where we got the golden seed. Just kind of recapping from last night in my own brain. Um, we never tried walking on the spiraled sword, but I don't think that would lead anywhere, if, even if we did. That we had a uh, Ash of War there. Um, okay, we'll work back and then we'll just go back onto that balcony. Uh, how do we get a Agila's spell? Oh, yes. Um, it's a side quest, it's pretty in depth. I don't know if I could fully explain it to you right now. Oh, there might be an item there as well. Okay, we'll, we'll get both of those things. They could be pretty worthwhile. All right, so on the roof, I guess, huh? That sword is crazy. This sword is the one that's just on the ground over there, the golden spear. It does look pretty amazing though. Oh. All right, so there's also a left side here. Hang on. This leads us to another part of the roof, which would lead us down to that altar. That didn't really give us anything, though. Okay. Whoop. So 
like another path down here as well. Oh, there is a window open here. Oh. Where's this lead though? Inside of a tree. Oh, there's a chest in here. Oh my god. Worth exploring. The Erd Tree Bow. Erd Tree Bow. Probably a quality bow. Quality faith. All the Erd Tree stuff seems to be faith scaling, which makes sense because they're all like golden knights. Makes makes a lot of sense. R2D2, thank you for the membership. Also my stats. Yeah, no problem. There you go. Uh, minus five from everything though, because I'm using a, a rune right now. That gives me all the f five on every stat. You can pause it. Um, <gasps> what is this interesting item location? Golden Order Principia. Probably a key item. Look like a faith book. Gradigan's Rings of Light, Law of Aggression. Got to give it to a cleric. All right, we found a lot of cleric books here. Like, honestly, I guess faith builds could be late game as well because we are in the end area. So, we found so many of the cleric things. Plus not. Well, this is a special weapon, Chaotica, so it's technically plus eighteen. I guess. I don't know what the special weapons go to. Maybe ten, twelve. Really not sure to be honest. Mm, okay, I guess we can go give the boss a try. Our first fight of the stream will be a boss. Ah, gold-eyed enemies drop four times the souls. I could see that. That makes sense. Oh, uh, specials only go to plus 10. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'm, al I'm almost a max special weapon then. Oh, yeah. Where's the golden spear before we do this? Can I warp to it easier than just running around at the top here? So honestly, if I had to say the hardest boss so far, just based on that question, for me it was Radon, but like that's, it's not because it's like, it's just the way the fight is. How it's like a, a summoning, like horse riding boss, not my style. Okay, I'm going to look that way and see if we can get a warp point closer to it. Maybe the West Capital Rampart. How much vigor do I have? I think around 32 normally. Nice. So where is that? There we go. We're closer to that sword. Much closer. All right. Yeah, we went in the de the sandy area. Got to get over there. So to do that, we can just jump down. Can we just jump down or do I have to take the, the sword path? I guess I can take the down path here. What kind of build? So we started strength intelligence, but I found so many dex intelligence weapons that I decided to reallocate about halfway through. And this katana has been doing wonders, honestly. I've been loving it so much. Oh! I got the... For that, I must backstab you. I don't know if you can backstab these enemies, actually. Alright, we found out we can. Alright, so we just gotta jump down here, I guess. Um... Okay, we can recheck that, Jaren. I didn't. I really didn't see that. I guess because I jumped up to get the item. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What the... I guess nighttime is setting in currently. <laughs> that was, oh, there's an item here as well. Strip of white flesh. Oh, weird. How do we get down lower? Did I jump last time? This area is so big. I don't think we can survive that fall. Right? Maybe? What if I land on that ledge? Or the building there. You know what? Let's just go see if this is... I don't know. It's got to be a different way down. Uh, I like Sekiro. Sekiro just had a lot less customization. I wouldn't say it's my favorite, but like I like all Souls games. I just prefer uh, Dark Souls, like most of the Souls games, as opposed to Sekiro. Like all of Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Bloodborne. I put Sekiro like just down based on... It doesn't have an online, so there's not as much replayability for me. And uh, no customization. It's okay, I could take the safe route here. We're good. I guess I'm misjudging how much fall damage Sekiro has. In Dark Souls, that shit would hurt. In this, I, I could probably survive that, yeah. Alright, we got some doggos behind me. Bap. Wow. Wow, the angle is really screwing up my kill. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that, I heard about that. That's really funny. I know, like, the one the one cool thing about this game as opposed to other Souls games is if you get stuck, 
There's so many different routes for you to go to. You don't have to fight and kill that one boss. I mean, you're eventually going to have to for Margaret because it's a, a progression point, I suppose. But, I mean, it's kind of like a teaching you have to learn how to dodge and play properly, you know, not just spam R1, so. I mean, most of the Souls games kind of teaches you that in their own way because you'll keep dying if you keep doing that. <laughs> Your mom, thank you, though. Okay, so, now we're down. There's the sword. We gotta go a little up. I never went up these stairs. This is an area that I've never been to. Yo, Salter, thank you so much, man. How have you been, by the way? Have you been enjoying Elden Ring? Whoop. Whoop. Backstab chain. Whoop. Oh. That's a lot of knights coming my way. That's a lot of damage. I didn't expect the other two to be coming this way. <laughs> we need some more. Yo, honestly, the best thing about this katana, totally it's weapon art. It's crazy good. Look at that damage. Just like melts enemy. This guy could have backstabbed me. <laughs> but he wanted to counterattack instead. There we go. Oh, there's still a perfumer here. Ah, I've never been to that staircase ledge either. Okay, we're gonna go up towards the sword though. That's the main point right now. Ah, this is the Moonvale katana. Oh well, there's still a knight here. All right, so how does one get onto there from above? Might have to go above. God, the ring that boosts jump attacks really boosts jump attacks. <laughs> like, it makes it do so much damage. I feel like we definitely have to drop down from above. Okay. Determination. Next boss, gravity. Yeah, we gotta go up one more layer to get that item. There's definitely... I've been up there, so I'm not worried. I know there's a way. I thought he died from that. Oh, another item over here. There's still some parts I didn't search here. What is this? More runes. Always appreciated. I will take all the money I can get. I'm also doing this thing in this first playthrough to see what soul level we get to. Just, you know, leveling, not trying to stop at all. Buying items and just playing normally. And currently I'm level 105 and... I don't know how... I don't think we're that close to the end of the game. So... To be honest... I wonder what soul level people will PvP at the most. I'm thinking maybe like 130, depending on like how much harder it gets to level. Okay, so is there a grace point above where I'm looking right now? Maybe I have to backtrack down where I have never been. Um, let's go up this way. Yeah, this seems promising because I've never... Ah, it's a dead end. I've been on the other side of that though, I think. So maybe I have to go up the tree branch. True, vitality doesn't exist, so endurance is kind of like a two-in-one stat. That's true. The only thing that like deters me a little bit is that Int has a lot of requirements that are very high for some of their spells. They're like 70. <laughs> so that's a little different. Man, yeah, this is, okay, let me just think. If I go from Erd Tree Sanctuary, I get this tree Perhaps I can go up on these buildings that are in front of me. And that might help me out in my progress here. Alright, so we're up here. If I go out... I've gone out this way, right? And I've gone up on the branch from another direction. This was a dead end. Okay, yeah, we have to go this way. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Yeah, that's always been a thing for Dark Souls for me. Oh. I don't know if I've ever walked over here. I have not walked over here. Smithing stone plus five. This place is enormous. This might be the biggest place in the game. Not Maybe not on size, but based on the fact that everywhere is a, a place you can search. Like, there's housing everywhere. And you can jump on all the roofs, which is, like, so different for a Souls game, you know? 
Damn, I need to get over there. Wait, ooh. That won't lead me there. So we're gonna go... This way leads me down. Man. There's gotta be a way to get... I mean... Parkour exists. Whether this is meant to be a place you parkour to, we will see. Ah! It's not. It's not meant to be a place you get to. But that staircase... Definitely leads to where I need to go. Okay. I see something that we might be able to do. This is different. I've never been here. Okay. This seems to be working. <laughs> well, let's kill this quick. Is it roofs or roofs? I say roofs. Oh, yes. Now. Now. Where's my cat ring? This is looking hella sketchy. Um, I'm not like trying to overkill it. I don't think we could jump over this roof. Oh! Never mind. You really have to force it. fall I swear to god this was such a mission bolt of grand six is that all that's up here yeah we can't get by there we can get that item there though nice item acquisition <laughs> what is this stone sword key okay what is that weapon that was a spear right it looked like a spear some of the talus oh no it's a spear okay it's a again quality faith Oh, it's their, it's their horn. Oh my god. Okay. Found their horn. That's how you go into the sewers originally. Um. Alright, so we found the, the horn blower's weapon. Um. Oh, that wasn't the weapon? Hang on. It looks so similar. Hang on. Was it another golden spear? Oh, it was this. It was Bolt of Grand Six. My bad. You're right. Ancient Lightning Spear. Quality build. More decks, though. Hmm. If it has, like, an interchangeable weapon art, this might do well as a, uh, alternative. Wait, no. For our ice magic. There's so many weapons that look slightly the same. I haven't really used a spear yet, so... I mean, obviously this is too weak to kill them, the, the best, but we'll see like how it, how it fights. Oh, does it do lightning damage? It does. Okay. Let's see the weapon art, yeah. Oh, damn, okay. That could probably get very strong. Did I just poise that? I feel like I did. Let's try and hit him again with it in CP. It's very slow, but I mean, it's fine overall. <laughs> That's pretty sick, though. That that one might not have an interchangeable weapon art then, uh, based on what I just saw. Most of the unique weapon arts, kind of like how our katana has like this, um, are just accustomed to the blade. Okay, I think What's I mean it did okay for me not having stats for that. You know what I mean? Have I been in there? I feel like I might have I remember killing a guy with a bow Okay, I think we've done oh all that we can do we can probably go fight the boss now Oh shit, that does a lot of damage though Just throwing that out there. He just kind of fires that like a turret so weird to me. I still sometimes forget that you can jump. Oh. And then that goes down into the swamps. Yeah. Alright. Let's go see what the boss is doing then. Again. I gotta leave the aggro so I can teleport. I did find the Moonlight Greatsword. Yes. I did. Yeah, we, we went pretty in-depth with the quest line to get it. Um, 
Damn, I need to not be aggroed by an enemy, but I think I have to kill that knight. In order to warp, because he's still over there just firing bows. Oh, we're good. Okay. I know what I'm using. Yeah, there's so many. The capital has a lot of uh, quality and strength faith weapons. Like, a lot of faith weapons in general, I suppose, but... What do we have here? Anything that we're missing? No, nope, we should be good. Okay, let's go see what this boss is all about. Did the dung eater show up? Uh, I don't think I fed the dung eater. I didn't... Oh, before we... Okay, well, hold up, hold up. Before we fight the boss, I we forgot to do this last night. We were supposed to go see what the dung eater said after we uh, freed him from his cell. Where is he? That's the fingers. The dung eater is at the back of this area here. Let's see if he's still there. Oh, seems like he's not there. We did something. We did something. I'll defile you next. Come to the outer moat. The outer moat. Come to the outer moat. I wonder if he means like somewhere in the capital. Hmm. That hat though, right? Isn't it beautiful? I thought it might be this, but no, it's not this. This isn't a moat. Called out. Yeah, we gotta kill him now, but I have no idea where he is, so perhaps we'll go. Is there an outer moat of the city, though? I was thinking that, but is this what they're considering a moat, I guess? Maybe? <laughs> Weird if they are. Moat of the city? He was in the... I guess, but there's so many things it could possibly be, I guess. Um, I wonder what... Oh, this. There's an outer mode here. Oh, that looks like it's a cave entrance. Ooh. That's the only one that looks like it has a cave entrance. Maybe we'll go check that out really quick. Yeah, that was... Okay. So... Yeah, this way. Maybe this way. Actually, I don't think I've... Yeah, I didn't run this way at all. I followed the path. We didn't go off this... Whoa. There's multiple things here. Whoa! Man, do you know how many of these ulcerated demons I have killed now? Five, I think? Maybe? Maybe more? This wall is kind of in my way. Could you break those kindly, sir? Why is there so many of these? I want him to break these things so we have like an open area. Nice. Perfect. Now I can do stuff and not worry as much. That's terrifying still though. At least this one isn't scarlet rotting. Definitely seeming aggressive right now though. Oh, we got him with a got him with a knock. That's crazy. Where's his face? Oh, another one. Yeah, yo, for how demonic and annoying these things are to kill, to be honest, like if you don't know what you're doing, they are hard. There's a lot of them. Okay. Oh, they give golden seeds. That's why they're they're more often found now. I see. I see. Yeah, it's the seeds that they're dropping. We found one in the capital. Nice. Okay. Giant crusher. Ooh, strength weapon probably. Giant hammer, right? Giant crusher. Endures what it comes with. That's a, that's a bit. That's Lido's hammer. <laughs> Sixty strength. Endure. I'm guessing just like perseverance naturally. So it like swung like a regular grade hammer. Yeah, but you spin instead. The R2 is a front flip. Okay, 
Can we appreciate that? That's pretty cool, you know? It's pretty inventive for switching up a great hammer. Running attack. It's a spin. Jumping R2. Looks ridiculous. <laughs> All right, you know, strength does have some fun weapons. When we go strength base, we're going to have some cool things to do. Yo, Poncho, thank you so much, man. Um, I don't know. I don't like dual wielding that much in the game. I know it has hyper. I guess I could. I don't really have a really good other katana, though, so it wouldn't really add to the moveset. And I like using the weapon art of this the most anyway, more than the dual wielding. I like the two-handed damage bonus, the running heavies. But we definitely will be trying out everything eventually. Just a huge fan of the katana at the moment, one-handed, or two-handed. Pretty fast, though, yeah. Okay, so our goal was to go to the cave, though. That was like a side thing. Wait, any other things here before we take our leave? No, seems good. When will you be dual wielding katanas? You can use weapon arts while power sensing. Yeah, yeah, I know. But then, like, while I'm not power stancing, I have to do the dual-wield moveset, and the two-handed attacks tend to do more stagger damage, if you know what I mean. So, when I do, like, jump heavies and stuff, when two-handed attacks, they do more stagger damage. Same with, like, even the heavies and stuff. Which is nice for certain areas, like the poisy enemies. Was, uh, the Pursuit, was it that fast? Um, it was pretty quick. Perseverance seemed pretty quick to me. Especially on, like, the Cestus and stuff. Missionary's Cookbook. Oh, and a new grace point. Okay. Oh, yo, now, finally. We haven't seen a uh, Estus upgrade in a while. Um, okay. Golden Order Seal. That seems like it would be a key item. When in fact it's not. Maybe it's a talisman, maybe? Uh, it's not at the top of any, so yeah, it might be. Huh. Oh, no. Nope, not a golden. These really look like it. I guess it's a consumable. Jeez. So annoying to go through all of them. Have you tried washing pole with bloody slash? I haven't seen the washing pole yet. I would have tried it for sure. Um... Did I miss it as a talisman? I am blind, boys. There's so many items in my inventory. I must be blind. I really don't see it in the talismans, do you? These look like it, but it's, it's not it. Oh, it's, uh, you mean like a casting tool. Oh. I guess it's confusing coming from Dark Souls 3 to this, because talismans are... Ah, yes, 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 yes. It's a catalyst. I see, I see. I thought you meant it was a talisman. I was like, oh, like a ring now. So it's... A, oh, it's a dark scaling one, though. Probably for the holy magic, since all the holy stuff scales off of... Okay. Cool. All right. Now, where is the... Okay, to the right of here, apparently. Um, ooh, right in the side of the castle, I suppose. An item awaiting us. Smoldering butterfly. That's such a weird thing to have waiting there. Um, oh, that's not even where it is. That was just an item. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to say holy magic is like the equivalent to dark damage, like the way it scales. Okay, more on this side. Uh, the Dung Eater kind of just appeared for me at the shrine. I'm really not sure what triggers him, but... I found him in the sewers of the capital afterwards. To access him, though, I, I needed a key given to me. What in the... This must be below where I am or something, because I don't see the hole. It's got to be down... Yeah, it's down in there for sure. Okay. I thought it was going to be like into the castle wall. Oh, damn. Okay. We go here. Damn. 
Damn, actually, have I even... I have never been down here. Whoop. Oh, and there's an Ash of War waiting for us right here. My plague, by the way. I am so bad at these. Oh, no. <laughs> Especially the ones that aren't, like, just straight. This one looks like it's going to be a joy. I think you can chase it with the horse instead of waiting for it. It's it's going somewhere. Okay, it must come this way. No! How did it go through me? I wish they would get stuck on you. Damn, you can't catch it. I have to intercept it. Damn it. I have to wait here. That's the worst. <laughs> yeah, I'll wait for it in the tiny area, I guess. Nice. Okay. Prayful Strike. That is... Grants... Okay, wait. Use a ball on axes and hammers. Okay. Then slam it into the ground. Inspired Blur restores HP to self and nearby allies. So it's an attack that, like, actually heals you as well. <laughs> okay. Kind of cool. So there's a lot going on with this moat. It's actually on the other side, though. This would bring us up top. We don't want to go back up, though. So we go this way. That's a pretty cool-looking faith, though, weapon art, though. No, I haven't found any fire ashes of war. Now that you mention that, I wonder what area those are found in. That does sound fun for a strength build. I, I can't even deny. That sounds pretty cool. Um, I can't open the map right now, sadly. I wanted to see... Oh, hole over there. I was going to say, what side of the wall is it on? But we found the dungeon. Let's go. What is this area called? I definitely see a blacksmith. Oh yeah, no problem guys. So it's uh, in here, you like go down near the, before the capital, near the outer wall phantom tree, and then you go into the water and it's in here. Um, let me level up quick. Yeah, you can, you can have no skill on, like, is it only for shields or can you actually do it to weapons too? That'd be really funny. But yeah, you can do that. Let's see, we can level up once. Our dex is still scaling nicely. Our more HP would also be nice, to be honest. Let's get a little bit healthier here. And then we'll put our dex a little bit more. We could also waste that item and get our, our health bonus back. What's our health supposed to be? You can check by looking at your levels. If you hug the waifu, she lowers your HP a little bit. So it's supposed to be 1170, but... Uh, Oh, I'm, I'm wearing a rune. <laughs> I was like, oh, how do I have more? But that makes sense. Okay. Oh, this obviously had to be that. Yeah. I hear someone like hammering back here. Sealed tunnel. Wow, we one shot those guys. They're usually very tanky. So that's interesting. Yeah, I haven't found any fire ash of war banana yet. I have not. Yeah, that one was the most obvious. We found some pretty good hidden ones, though, but that one... That one was pretty straightforward. Oh, I thought that was a trap chest. The timing of this guy's smoke bomb. <laughs> Smithing stone miner's bill. Okay, we can give that to the twin old woman at the shrine. Yeah. Found only one fire one. Yeah, I feel like there's a lot less of them. Or they're in an area that we haven't been to yet. Oh, I was like, why am I not gaining HP back? <laughs> what is this? Cracked crystals? Got some cracked crystals. 
I will never. How could I not want this helmet? Look at it in all of its glory. The only reason I would ever change it is for the poise that the whole Radon set grants. But like, man, look at, look at, where's my fluky hat? Where'd it go, you know? This is like a red Super Saiyan. This is basic. The floopy hat knows all. <laughs> um, actually, is this a fog wall? This looks a little suspicious. Okay, I was wrong. Wait. Okay, well, I've been right a lot of the time, so let's let's not judge. Guess where we came in. That goes that way. That goes that way. There must be another path. Was that it? Just a bunch of miners? I feel like there's more to this tunnel if it was hidden so well. Hmm. Ah! I knew I heard more noises. There's a lift here, let's go. Oh, could that be a secret? That was a tree branch. Hmm. On the way out, we're going to go back up there. I wonder what this is. <laughs> they are pretty funny with their freaking hidden walls that lead to nowhere. Oh, well, let's turn around, guys. It's the end. <laughs> I love that they try to bait you. Okay. Um. Let's see. I can go across. Get there. Probably the best first thing to do. I love that smoke doesn't actually do anything, but... You die. You die. You both die. Oh, we're alive. What the? <laughs> um, now we can get FP back through backstabs. Okay, items down. Oh, there's still people in here throwing smoke bombs. Hey, man. I want your back. Okay. Hidden wall. No, actually not a hidden wall. Okay. Dominic, thank you so much, man. Or Dominique. <laughs> thank you. Uh, I appreciate all the memberships, guys. As I'm platforming here. I guess we just jump down. Uh, there's a ladder there. Um, don't think there's anything that way. Whoop. Plunge! Uh, he came per That's not a normal enemy. That's terrifying. Could you kindly close your uh, weird looking mouth there? Woo! Jump attack. Open art. These things ever get staggered? No. Whoop. Doesn't seem like it. I don't like that. That's weird. Are we stopping soon? No, we're still going. We're Beyblading. Ah. Walk the dog. Get away. Woo! Okay, we're good. <laughs> Oh no, I need that thing alive to break this. I saw that last second. Oh, that's rough. That's annoying. Actually, could that even break that? Probably, we're gonna have to come back down here and get that. That is, that is an L. Yeah, that sucks. Didn't notice that until we killed it. That's a Sag. It's okay that we can still look around before we come do that. Damn, I was so I was so into the fight. I didn't look behind me and see that. It's the wheel from Return to Oz. <laughs> um, okay, this must lead to the next area. We're gonna have to walk out anyway, right? Or we can. There were two things I wanted to check. So, wait, is this where we came in? This isn't where we came in, right? No, we didn't climb the ladder. This is different. Where did we? And these things confuse me sometimes. I think it is because that's the brand I wanted to jump on. 
This is indeed where we came in. <laughs> right? Yes. Yes, it is. It's so weird. I guess the tree led me to the same height. Okay. And let me see if I can uh, platform onto that. Is there a reason this is here? Other than... Oh, I gotta jump even higher. There's actually an item there. Okay. So I gotta look on that side of the wall. Actually, yeah, you know what? We, we may as well reset because we can get that object at the same time. Yeah, that's a that's a good call. That's a good call. It'll bring the thing back to life that we can break. What pain. We could run by the early enemies at least. It's not too far. I really hope that thing resets. I don't remember if they did it in the Liernia like castle area. I think they did. I hope they did. <laughs> Otherwise, rip, rip that item. Okay, so we want to look left when we go on the elevator. Or was it right? I think it might be right. Is it a ledge? There's a ledge there. There's a ledge there. Did we just kill something? What in the hell? Where was the uppermost branch? So many like less ledges. That that is it that one right there? That one I think is the Yeah, that one's the most upper little tree branch, I believe. Nice. Yeah, 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 okay. Smithing stone. And what over here? Wanna miss any items on the way down? My hat is uh, impairing vision, but it's okay. <laughs> it's all for fashion. Alright, we're good. Now we can go see if we uh, can break that statue. Ooh. Jump through the trees. Oop. We do have to kill the little ninjas again, I think. Probably. I guess I could easily just go here and then kill them before they jump down. Yeah. Oh my, I can't see. Okay, I'll use my senses. <laughs> Sorting hat senses. All right, um, that thing is in the corner. How many more ninjas are down here? We gotta lure that over here. Oh, geez, that didn't take long. Holy speedy. All right, come get me, buddy. No, don't actually come get me. You know, you're supposed to, you're supposed to break this, buddy. Right here. Oh, there, okay, you know, I'll take a hit for that. I'll take a lot of hits for that, but that's fine. All in the process of getting the loot I desire. Oh, right in my face. I'll get rid of it quick. Hey, hey, why you all, why you all weird? Why you acting weird? Ah! Okay. We're good. Oh, a smithing three smithing stone sixes. Okay, that, that's worth. I'll take that reset for that. That's fine. Let's go back up. Oh. <laughs> hey. I know. There's a plus one one heady as well. Uh, the great jar arsenals is uh, vastly. It's like the stronger Havel's ring, basically. Okay, so we just head forward now, I guess. We still have that one ninja left right there. Oh, this, this guy will give us HP back. Oh, or we'll just hit him out of the air by accident. Oh, well. No big deal. <laughs> I don't understand where these things come from. How they're here every day. <laughs> uh... Okay, okay, I can't I can't limbo under that. That's sad times. Can I parkour above it though? I I can, but then I can't see. But we're just gonna Oh! Oh! <laughs> Alright, that was a little bit of a trap. 
Oh, well, lots of items. That was a good one. Impair vision and then explode when they land. Not a bad one. <laughs> Added up to here with the explosions of these things. Shit. Oh, that was like right when it was exploding. Wow. I'm not a wizard. I just... I. Hey, listen. Even Harry had a sword, okay? Gandalf had a sword. All these wizards have swords. Why are you... Why are you judging me for my non-magic ways? I got a magic sword. Uh, Damn you, but there actually was a hidden wall there. <laughs> that's really funny. Okay, that's a progression point we can go towards. Um, Let me just check here. That's not. Okay, that might be the only one. Unless... Okay. That's pretty funny. We're going down more. Alright, well. Let's try not to jump and miss any of the treasures that this tunnel may... Oh, there's one. No, wait, there's, there's a way. This way. That tree can lead me to there, correct? Yes. I might not misjudge the jump height. There we go. Nice. Parkour. There? Or that branch? Probably there. This can lead back up there. Why why does it do that? Is there an item there that I don't see? No. Down we go. Oh god. <laughs> Alright. I'll take it. Hey Chip, thank you so much for the membership as well. Yeah, I'm using the Moonvale katana. I'm actually gonna just make a short video just showing where to find it, because I get asked that like a billion times a stream. Totally fair. Oh, okay, we're, we're boss fighting, I guess. Uh, Onyx Lord. He looks the same as the old gravity guy. And indeed, he seems to fight the same. We do a lot of damage. Indeed, we do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Some lord. Although we got his sword, I guess. Onyx Lord's great sword. That's what it was, right? But it was like a curved great sword. At least it looked like a curved great sword. There we go. It is an int weapon. Weapon art. A very big gravitas. Not bad. It's got good damage, to be honest. 259 right away. I mean, I guess it's it's more of a str no. It's yeah, it's more of a strength int, I guess, than it would be a dex int. So there's a couple strength int weapons we found. Not as many as the dex, but pretty good amount. Wait, hold up. Why would I warp out when there's more here? What are you talking about? Where are we? Oh, is this? <gasps> oh, damn! This is where we're gonna have to take the grace of the boss that's way at the top. Hey, convenient finding this. I wouldn't have even, like, I would not have found this How had we not been trying to side quest the dung eater right there. Definitely not. Like, what? It's like, it doesn't even look like it's branched or connected to there. I probably would have tried to go here. That's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, the flail is Dexin. Yeah, Michael, there's a, there's a lot of Dexin weapons, actually. Divine Tower of West Atlas. Yeah, it probably won't. It'll be blocked until we kill the boss. Okay. That wasn't even where we were going to kill the Dung Eater. But hey, uh, you know, all in all, that was worth it. No idea where Dung Eater is then, to be honest. I guess I can look on this side of the moat instead of this side. There are two sides. And then if we don't find him there, we'll just go fight the boss. 
Did you ever go back up the cage uh, to the lever at the start of the stream's boss room? Uh, like back into the sewers, kind of where the... Wait, where am I going really quick? Straight ahead to the water part? Okay. Yeah, well, we'll go to... We'll start at like... I don't know. Where can we even access it? Over here, probably? Oh, wait. Hang on. Wait, there's a way better place to warp to. <laughs> okay. Much superior warp point. So this is where we fought Sir Horsey of Doom. Um, yes, we can access the down area there. Uh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, fought Margaret more than once, I guess. Oh yeah, I guess it, there's a couple places outside the walls that I just never went to. There is a jump down point. That's kind of cool. Ooh, wait. No, that's not... Wait. No, this is where I want to be. Yeah, okay. We're good. We're good. Where is that, by the way? I don't think I've been there either. Hold up. Hold up. This place is huge. Wait. Where's Papa Bear? Where there's baby bears, there's Papa Bear. And we're baby bear. Could you break this? Ah, uh, baby bear is not strong enough. You weakling. I have no use for you. Where's your mother? Where is your mother? There's mama. Oh boy. Oh, well, to be fair, I did murder her child. Okay. This way, mama. Follow the wizard. Well, the sword wizard. This way. Right here. Come get me. Perfect. You guys suck, though, and you'll continue to suck. Oh, uh, yeah. I think that's like a lingering hitbox, and then... Ugh. There, that's your other child. You couldn't protect her. What say you? You're gonna try to eat me, I know. And now we have regen. You can jump your paws. Give me them paws. Oh, I don't want those paws though. Nice. Come here. All right. Nice. What do you drop me? Your blood. Nice. <laughs> Smithing stone plus six times two. Okay, I guess you know what? upgrade stones are always worth it. Check the doorway here first. Where do you lead us? Into what seems like maybe a part of the underground. Is this gonna be a well? Man, are we about to sit on a really long elevator? <laughs> Let's see, is it actually leading the underground? Nope. Is this the folk, the the hero's cave again? Uh, Arizo hero's cave. Okay. Uh, how do you think having this game be open world affects the overall source experience? I feel like if they take the time, they could have a much easier experience. I mean, I know the so the AI is definitely improved. I feel like the bosses roll catch you better and stuff. So people that spam roll when they panic, you know, it's gonna it's gonna wreck them a little bit at first. But if they take down a time to learn, maybe use the Ash summons that I don't use really because I like to fight the bosses, like without the summon and the aggro. I have a lot of these keys. We can go in here. Um, I think it, it could be a lot more like diverse for people to have ways to beat bosses, fawns, personally. All right, so we use the stone sword key. Let's see. Oh, that's not. Oh, God. Why would you have so many of these death frogs? I hate them so much. Golden epitaph? Epitaph? Ep epitaph. Epitaph. It is a faith weapon that causes blood loss and it looks kind of cool. What's this weapon art? Seems like it raised the epitaph to grant the effect of sacred order to yourself and allies. 
particularly effective at laying to rest those who live in death. Ah, so yeah, all, I mean, all holy weapons make it so skeletons don't re live, they don't come alive again. Hmm. Epitaph. <laughs> Should do this. Thank you, though, Fawns. Damn, seven months, dude. That's crazy. Supporting this sword wizard. <laughs> Ay, that's a... This looks like the hero cave again, man. You know how many times you've been to this hero cave? Like, three different times. Yikes. We did jump on it last time, though, so we've made some progress with this. This place just sucks. I go back? Why are we going back? Did I miss something? Yikes. Actually, let's, uh... Let's get, let's get a level in here. It's okay, you know what? We'll keep this on us since you guys are panicking. <laughs> okay. But hang on, I want to level up too. Do we have a level? This is a time where we can take the time to use a rune or two, just so we like if we die to that chariot, because that thing does one shot you, just so you know. Um, it's annoying. It's not really like a boss. Oh wow, really? <laughs> but it is like a a stage hazard that will crush you. And we can get so many levels by doing this. I don't want to crush this because I want to see what the regular leveling is like without using those items. Um, but... Okay. Christian, thank you so much though. My fat rolling with that sword. Wow, I have a lot of weight load still. This katana is awesome. Okay, I'm pretty sure... Also, it respawns when I leave, huh? All right, let's do this. I'm trying to think of the best timing to go. Probably when it goes up. How did you live that, man? That is crazy. Ooh, I was kind of late on that. We'll see how this turns out. I don't like that seal. Looks a bit sketchy. I guess it's the summon seal. Oh. <gasps> My god. Let me turn around and freaking die. <laughs> Jeez. That would have been rough. I'm glad I happened to stop in the archway for whatever reason I was thinking. I have no idea. Whoa, this one's a road. It's got lanes. It's getting more and more complicated the more we get into these stupid fucking... Um, there's a middle path, though. That's kind of okay. That's kind of makes it seem a little bit better. We don't seem to need this sword right now. I feel like people were exaggerating. Okay, let me think here. That one's going down. The other one's going up. So we want to go on the right side when that one goes up, basically. Probably zigzag actually. It's like this one's not too bad. Oh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Why are we doing three sixties and shit? Okay. Cutting lanes, good sir. Around we go. Get over here. Oh! Fuck! <laughs> I didn't expect a third one! <laughs> well, that got me. <laughs> Christ. Bruh! 
<laughs> I turned my camera. I think I'm safe. There's a whole other one there. Oh my god. <laughs> that's funny. Okay, that's not so bad. So there's three. Noted. Noted. <laughs> Good God. Yo, I'm not uh, trusting anything. There might be a fourth. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you, Miyazaki. Indeed. Okay, we stop here. For good heaven's sake. Okay, let me follow. Gotta get here really quick. On the double lanes. Get to our little checkpoint. And this crosses. Go, go, go. Cross this road. Alright, alright. It's not so bad when you know what you're doing. It's just the surprise that happens. Oh! oh my god. <laughs> I thought I got hit by a wheel. I was like, what now? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh! Please! Stop it! Fuck, why are they so close together now? They were so separate before. Oh, okay. How do I deal with this? Okay, we can't be stopping for that item. We'll die. Yikes. Where do we even go? Okay. Nice. That's a little more on the complicated side than the other one. Hang on, is this, uh, what, what's happening here? This looks just like the area that we fought the last boss in. Let me just get free health gauge. And FP. This place is hell. It's a form of it, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, I need you to, yeah, come at me with the sword. Oh, I didn't. Forgot the double hit that skeleton. I want him out of the corner. I want to backstab him, but can I? Nah, oh well. Hmm. Okay. Oh, this joyous, a joyous occasion indeed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice. Two crucible knights, hand in hand. I wish I could backstab him. That would make this a little bit easier. Oh my god, okay. He's not bad on his own, but mixed with Sir Crucible and all over there. Okay, I need to bait both of them at the same time. One of them takes a lot of magic damage, and I think it was uh, not Ordovis. He's weaker. Yeah, he's definitely a bit weaker. Okay. Okay. Definitely have to like, because Ordovis has the shield, so he's super, super passive as a boss. Damn, how did that not hit? Whoop. Let's get out of there. Alright, I wish I had- Whoop. Nope, nope, nope. I know you well. I fought Ardovis quite a lot. Not not in this playthrough, but the network test team is like the coolest thing that I've had other than Margaret, I guess. Yeah, bring your screwdriver on me. I thought, I thought that might work out a little bit more in my favor, but it didn't seem so. Whoa! Oh, I forgot about that attack. That's quite scary. Oh. Did I 
bat roll when I got it. Damn. <laughs> Another FP flask would be nice, but I think we can make it work. It's fine. Let's see. Hang on a second here. Yeah, I don't need that anymore. What is this? Boost FP restoration for Silurium and Flask. Do I have like a regen one? That'd be awesome. Wait, I have a holy negation. Pretty sure they do holy damage. Okay. Damn, that comes out so quick. It looks like I'm like spacing it, but I, I didn't. Get our regen going here a bit. Okay. So, uh, I actually like how I also hit Ordovis when I wasn't trying to. Man, this is kind of nice. I had like a little alone time with him right there. Damn, that attack. I swear. He leans into it. Okay, get over here with your attacks. There we go. Nice. Perfect. A little on the slow side. Okay. Yeah, I wish I wish I had an FP regen, that'd be nice. It's okay though, that the running heavies actually seem to do pretty good damage against him. Two splashes. Oh well, you know what? I'll hit you just for fun. Just because I know what you do. Okay. Get full because our Dovis is uh, on my asshole here. I was gonna continue that, but eh. Uh, okay, we got one more flask here. We're chilling. Oh, that goes through the pillar? We're not chilling. But I could use the pillar for cover. Oh, I, oh, I was gonna. Oh, I did get hit by that. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. I think he dies from one more of these. No, he almost died. Rough. He has like what pixel HP left. Nice. Okay. <laughs> what a bait. <laughs> okay. Nice. Good. Okay. Double swing. <laughs> ah, the pillar actually cucked me. That's funny. I actually couldn't see. Not the tail whip. Not that. Okay, that would have been like a triple roll catch. Let's hand it to him when he has his dragon tail. He's a little bit harder. Hey. Although he loves that move right now. Wait, doesn't that have like a second? Yeah. Okay, we have a lot of Estus. That attack and the other guy have a very different ranged attack of that. Oh, that wasn't damaging at all. What the hell? It was like his weakest attack. Get down, boy. All right, Ordovis's great sword, his crucible helm, armor, and gauntlets. Oh damn, we got all of them. What's the poise on that set? I wonder. Do you think it's more or less than? It's actually like one less than. Uh... Okay. Still very good though. It's a bit lighter as well. So depending on like how much absorption you have, you might prefer it. Nice. Not bad. 
You have become the network test. True, everybody wore that damn armor set. You're not lying. And yet still we didn't find the dung eater. <laughs> um, okay. Let's warp out of here, I guess. I too like my hat. <laughs> Uh, it's really up to you what order you fight the demigods in, but I think Radon should be done. Hang on, I'm gonna go sit at the warp point. Like, why would I don't know why it doesn't bring us back to the freaking grace point? Yeah, now we check the waters. Go test the waters. I know, I still didn't do the moat. <laughs> Damn it. They're gone. Yeah, we're going to the moat. Okay. Um, I can go look at more of the round table, but we did look at where he was supposed to be. Your armor kind of looks like a beard in the dark. <laughs> All right, this is new. We were, we don't. I don't think I've ever been down here either. Well, that's something. What's going on there, merchant? Merchant? No, it's the other dude. What are you looking at? Oh, you again, is it? Perfect bloody timing, actually. I got crab, cooked up fresh. Nice. We bought prawn from him last time. Right. There's something I should probably tell you. You heard of the Dung Eater? He's a madman. Ah. Has it out for everyone. Curses him. Goes round in his rank armor and all. You see him though. Stay. Well, away. I was in the same jail as him once, so I know first hand. He's a god forsaken monster. Not just some petty thug like me. Okay. He's a killer. Kills people and curses the souls. Does all sorts of shit to the corpses to keep them cursed forever. I ain't seen nothing more disgusting in all my years. I ever been more scared neither. Rooted to the bloody spot while he did that to my friend. Yeah. Wow. Then I was seen it here again. Never thought I would. So it's near here. What we are in the right to place. Those bodies. It was. It was him, that monster. He's lurking round there. Nice. Okay, let's buy his crab just to be nice. He's feeding us. Never met someone with a taste for crab I couldn't trust. You've got a real thing here, eh? <laughs> he said the same thing when I bought his prawn. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, there's so much potential here. Could be like in any of these. It could be. Ooh, can I? Ooh, that is definitely deep waters. We are not going there. So he's gotta be around here then, or at least he can smell him. Smell him. Could you smell in his direction, please? <laughs> I've been looking for his ass. Um. Well, it did. Okay. You can smell them. This is a moat. I feel like we've looked at all moats. We'll die in this moat, but maybe this is a shallow end here on the other side. Maybe the other side is just not as deep, and that that is deep right there. That's all. Possibilities. I don't see a cave. Yeah, we are searching for the poopy one. Because he told us to meet him by the moat. There's no way he's in the tunnel still where we found him, right? The wider end. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Let's go see there. Does it have to be night for him to come about? That's so weird. The time passing thing is kind of annoying, I will admit. If that is the case. It does look deep all the way, but I'll still travel all the way to that side to check. 
can jump here. Squirrels, a giant. Yo, the fifth hand. Thank you, man. Um, that is definitely too deep. So he's not in the water. Okay, we'll come back at night and see. Yeah. All right, what is the closest warp point? I guess this one's pretty damn close. We'll go there and just go to night. Like, it's not that I hate or love it. It's just annoying that you have to have, a like, a certain time of day for, a, like, a quest enemy to appear. That's that's annoying. If it wasn't for that, I would probably wouldn't mind it. I like the ever-changing, like, night, day, scenery-wise. Um, okay. Oh, wait, no, this is closer. We'll go here. I'm done. Oh, maybe, yeah, we searched both moats. Mm, I'll look at both. It's nighttime. We'll just look quick. No big deal. I'm using a dex in build. We started strengthened, but then we switched over. Don't you mean you're done? <laughs> I'm done with this done. I could go check in the sewer. That's where he's supposed to be, but it's weird because he said meet him by the moat. You know? So... That's a little bit strange. Yeah, I've already found the real one of him in the well. But this is like a different thing, I thought. We went to where he was to, supposed to... Oh shit, is this too high? This looks kind of high. Yeah. It looked a little bit less high <laughs> from where I was. Shit. Uh, you respect about the second area in the game. Second main area. Ouchie. Freaking horse deaths. You know, with all the cool things we have. Can I get a grapple hook, please? <laughs> oh, man. Let's find another turtle puzzle. I'm actually going to make a little quick video for that because of how much time we all spent doing that. And no one's uploaded a video for that. So the poor souls trying to do that. I swear. <laughs> that was the worst little puzzle thing in the game. That one was, the, was so ridiculous. <laughs> okay. There you go. All right, we're here at night. Wait, is this nighttime or did it switch? Cause I died. I swear to. God. I so help me, God. Is there anybody checking your menu what time of day it is? This isn't night. Oh my. Is this is night? This looks like day. It's like dusk. Yeah. Is he dead? Oh. <gasps> Serves me right. Fitting bloody end. For a jumped up little shit with big ideas. <gasps> Help me out. Would you, mate? I don't want to get cursed. <laughs> Just let me die. I don't want to live like this. Not anymore. So, please. We have to murder Dung Boy. Look what he's done. Oh. All right, Dung Boy. Come here. You know what you just did? You're going to die. And defile your corpse. I'm going to defile your ass. Come here. Weak. That crab is tougher than you. Oh, you have a place. 
shit eater. <laughs> Stupid crab. <laughs> Why am I still burning? Sword of Mist. Not prawn, man. I bought all of his cooking. <laughs> I don't even know what to say to that. Um, where is it? It said Sword of Mist. It kind of looked like a great sword. This. Oh, that's the God Slayer. Sword of Milos. Quality build. Causes blood loss. My hat's in the way. <laughs> great sword. Up in art. So many war cries. So many war cries. Uh, the good thing you can interchange those weapon arts usually. Damn it, Prawn Man, no. I guess he had to die for me to get invaded by him. Man, that sucks. I liked Prawn Guy, he was cool. Well, okay. Let's see what happens now if we go to the round table hold. I guess. Um, 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 over here? This side, yes. Kill the body. Oop. Well, we didn't kill the body, so... Yeah. Hey, he's back. I just kicked your ass. What's going on? What's up? There you are. Mad? Despite the curse stirring within you. How? I thought. Then it hit me. That you are, in fact... Me and I am the dung eater. It is no. my flesh that must receive the blessing. Give me your blessing. Defile my flesh with the seed bed curse again and again until it is done. Until a cursed ring coalesces and my one day defile order itself. Countless I have killed. And countless I have defiled. And soon the fruits will be born. Hundreds will be reborn cursed. And they'll bear thousands of cursed children. Who bear tens of thousands more. He's been planting his seed in everybody. Born just like me. And they'll kill and defile. And bless in my stead. The rotten fools. My fate was the grandest. Most brilliant of them all. Okay, so we're kind of progressing My his quest. My corporeal flesh lies in the sewer jail beneath the capital. Give it your blessing. Defile my flesh with the seedbed curse. Until a curse ring coalesces that may one day defile order itself. Okay. My corporeal... Give it your blessing until a curse... This seems like an interesting side quest, but <laughs> do I want to go give it... Do I want to go defile his human corpse? <laughs> Is that something we want to do? In the meantime, we can go fight the boss while we decide that, though. <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh. Hell yeah, you do. <laughs> okay, okay, we go do that first. All right. Um, Is there a warp point near him, though? Forsaken. He's in like the pretty far depths of the sewer, but he's not exactly where the boss fight was. But maybe we can backtrack. Do I want to cause the apocalypse? <laughs> I don't know what ending we're going for. Like what one we should be pushing for? Because we did do Ronnie's quest line, but uh, let's go fight the boss first before I wander around in the sewers again. Because that sewer sucked. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the Ronnie quest line would be, but we've been pursuing the witch, so let's just let's just for now go to the boss fight up here. I don't want dung eater ending, so we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. Yeah, we married the waifu. I don't want to not marry the waifu. <laughs> Traverse the mist. All right, what do we got? We got our flasks. Got everything gold in here. 
Oh, Cutscene. Graceless, tarnished. That sounds like Margaret. Or Godric. That's Margaret. What is thy business with these thrones? Ah, Godric the Golden. Hmm. The twin prodigies, Mikola and Melania. General Radan. Praetor Rikard. Luna Princess Rani. Those are their thrones, I guess. Willful traitors. All. Thy kind are all of a piece. Pillagers emboldened by the flame of ambition. His cane was a sword I all along. Thy meager grave. Felled by King Morgoth, last of all kings. Damn. All right, Morgan, it's it's Margaret 3.0. Okay, how's your fighting style? Is it similar to? Definitely different. Still got the dagger though, but now you've got a sword. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out what the openings will be here. Let's do that. Let's do that. Whoa! Didn't expect a pull. Holy, that's a long attack chain. Can we just appreciate that? There's the daggers. Does a one-handed cartwheel. I poised that. Comes a bird. All right, all right, all right. Pulling the shield out because I have no idea what to expect right now. Tail whip. Still got the hammer, I see. Damn. Okay, I want to get the region in. Oh, that is not good. Those are going to explode, aren't they? I got to the shield, but now it's still raining swords. My head itches. Oh no. Okay. Jump attack. Roll into the. Okay, I tried to roll by the hammer, but... Sometimes blocking, like, you get kind of, like, hit when you're blocking as you're going into the roll. He's throwing that, isn't he? Oh, hell yeah, he is. He's rushing with that, isn't he? <laughs> yeah, of course he is. There's more! I thought it was done! <laughs> alright, alright, let's get more to the middle here. Let the regen do a little bit of the work. Throws the knife, throws the knife. Gets real close for the hammer of doom. Oh, he's still going. Oh, but we stunned him. Free damage. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh. Oh, God. That's not Estus. That's rough. Jeez. Yeah. Right, hang on. Hold on. Hold on. Such shame. They cannot bear thy part in this. Shall not be forgiven. Damn, that went right through the shield, or I dodged right behind it. No. Oh, that's scary. Dodge away, something's gonna explode. What, is that a whip sword? Hold up. What is happening? That's gonna explode or some shit. Yikes. 
down. You beast. <laughs> you beast. Margot's great rune. <laughs> I'll take it. That better be better than the first great rune I got, I swear. Okay. Let's see what it says. Seek the. Oh, I have to go to the Atlas. Good thing we found the divine area that we need to go to. GG, though. Will there be a fourth Margot? Um, this looks sketchy. <laughs> but, like, I probably should go here, right? Why should we just jump into New Game Plus and cry? Oh my god, alright, whatever, we touch it. it. Oh wait, impenetrable thorns refuse all. None may enter the Erd Tree. Okay, that's somewhere we gotta come back to, it seems. Can't go into the Erd Tree. There's also a grace point here that for some reason I decided I didn't want to touch. Um... Oh. First waifu. Hello again, old friend. Allow me a moment to converse with you. You were unable to enter the Erd Tree, no? True. Prevented by the mantle of barbs. The thorns are impenetrable. A husk of the Erd Tree's being that spurns all that exists without. The only way to stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord is to pass the thorns. My purpose serves to aid in that very act. So I'd like you to undertake a new journey with me to the flame of ruin, far above the clouds, upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants. Then I can set the Erd Tree aflame and guide you down the path to becoming Elden Lord. Rolled medallion. Key item. A red mark was made on the map. Ooh, what else does Melina have to say though? I wish to journey with you once more to the flame of ruin. Far above the clouds. Upon then okay. and guide you. It's just the earth tree. Okay, cool. Well then, let's level Shall I up. Turn your root? Let my hand rest She's upon back you. leveling us up, nice. For but a moment. I love my I love share my them with me. <laughs> This your is thoughts, all you see. Your ambitions. Okay, we get two levels, the forty decks. You would follow. Another health. Well that's a big health. I'll, I like that health. I like that health a lot. All right, well, this is nice. So we got here. This is, I thought this was like close to end game, but we're going here apparently. But how are we going there? That's the question. We have to advance somehow. Intriguing. That's water. What else could be here? Let's look around the, the boss room. Yeah, we could try Radon's Great Rune. How many of them do I have? I have, I have 16. Kind of want to try. Oh, wait. First, we have to go down to the Atlas place so I can get the rune. Where was that? Over here. Uh, oh, yeah. We haven't done the Colosseum yet either. Okay. I do need to get rid of the debuff. I wonder how big it is. <laughs> do I just use it to get rid of the debuff? Is that really all I have to do? And I could hug her again if I want one back. Cause like it's temporary it just boosts my poise and it wastes my fp i feel like i feel like it's not worth it uh corpse i didn't see the boss corpse i'll go look again but you know just use it and okay that's weird that's a weird item so like a little bit of a health debuff and you have the ability to poise through again eventually oh shit oh god tarnished not but a fool the earth tree wards off all who 
Dana approach. We are. We are all forsaken. <laughs> Damn. None may claim the title of Elder and Lord. Thy deeds shall be met with failure, just as I. <sighs> Those are his last words. All right, well, screw it. Then we're also going to waste the... Um... What a sad ending to Margaret the Third. The first and the second, they died much earlier in this playthrough. Yeah, what a waste. <laughs> this item is lame. <laughs> okay. Now we go get our great rune. Teabag him. <laughs> now he's going to come back and kill me. It's going to be like the fourth Margaret. Alright, now that we have the actual way to make the rune, this should open. What? It's still shut? That's strange. We probably have to go do this first then. Let me think. Yeah, I guess they've sort of been like that. All right, to the place we've never been and to get there. Fastest way, Erdtree Sanctuary? I guess. I guess. Is the, is the other boss another Margaret? <laughs> Okay, let's, let's sit here for a second. <laughs> the fourth Margaret. Okay. Um, we can also put this back. This is basically doing a favor. The fourth one's kind of interchangeable, but I really have been enjoying the health and FP swappability that we get out of that, so we're good with that. Did I join the Volcano Covenant? No, not yet. I guess I could. Mm, we could either do the, the Volcano now, or we could do whatever this is. What do you guys think? Since we're here, maybe we should just do this and just complete this area nice and tight. Nice and clean. Um, This way? Yeah, we're already at the Coliseum, so... Curse the Dung Eater. No, I, that is, isn't that what he wants? I just realized that. Volcano has a secret boss as well. Ooh, well, that's good. I mean, this isn't the end of the game, so we're going to go there. We're already here. We may as well just complete this, I guess. 100% this area. Yeah, we'll just... Okay. Damn, I think I chose the wrong path, but can I parkour this? How high is this? Man, I'm like... It doesn't look that high, but... Oh, I didn't even take fall damage. Wow. Wow. High int, my, my katana scales extremely well off intelligence. See? B int scaling. Gets most of its damage from intelligence. I'm a wizard warrior. We don't use any of those peasant spells. None of that. Oh, uh, there is five demigods. What we just killed was another demigod. So, uh, wait, is it? I don't know. Whoop. You are so much tankier than I thought when I walked up on this fight. Like, wow. That, you are, like, basically a boss. Magic on my int build? Never. I'm a smart samurai. Wizard. <laughs> Yeah, we, I do want to find a way to duplicate the remembrances, by the way. Like, we did find the, the Colosseums. Ooh, this is another one. But, like, the Mausoleums couldn't duplicate Star Scourge or Full Moon. So, we have to check those. Um, another one of these. God damn. Oh, these were bosses that we fought in the past. That, this is the, the hammer, but made as an enemy instead of a boss. The Ritual Shield Talisman. It does. Ra raises defense when HP is at max. Oh my god, it's Lloyd's Talisman. Oh, 
That's pretty huge. That would be good with that, with the crit ring. Maybe I can sacrifice jump attacks, getting a boost. That's a nice ring right there. That's a nice one. Oh, I really, I really 100% thought I was about to go in that door. Didn't think that I'd have to run around. <laughs> um, big brain samurai shoot sword beam. Exactly. For calling finger. Can I horse here? I can't horse here. Yeah, you can only duplicate one remembrance per bell. And I've only seen the ones that I've used already. I don't know where any more are. So can we not duplicate Renal? I feel like we can because there's two possible things we can get from it. So but you're never at full HP. Oh, but we are. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes. Maybe I can swap it back and forth. Oh yeah, that could be fine. You know, I just thought about we'll keep the we'll keep the jump attack thing on, and then when I'm not at full health, we keep the health regen. When I am, whoop, right over to the Lloyd. So easy, so perfect. Yeah, we'll go. That'll work. Nice. Have fun, I'm beast. Enjoy it. Item. Star fist. Let's see. Yeah, I'll be playing this for Onward for sure. It blows Dark Souls 3 out of the water to me. So many more weapon choices. The world design is freaking huge. It's amazing. Actually amazing. Okay, this is weird. I don't really understand how we're getting into this call scene. We'll just kill these things really quick though. No, we didn't kill Melina. She's with us. Is there more to this tower? Hmm. That's a crack in it. That's not a shadow. I thought it was a shadow too for a second. Try the door. I did try the door. It didn't open. Hmm. Maybe there's something we haven't done. Have we been over there to that? Ah, I don't, oh, you don't think they can get into the Colosseum? Damn, okay. All right. I guess we're kind of done with this area then. Sort of. I do need to find a way to the next area though. This bridge maybe? Um, Cathedral of the Forsaken. Okay, I guess we do the volcano then. Let me just run along there and see if we uh, can pass into the new area. I just want to see what it looks like if we get there. Wait. Oh no, this is the stupid boss that's at the ground. That's the Cathedral of the Forsaken, not... Okay, maybe the East Capital? That's the bridge we need to get on for sure, but that's way above us right now. So, East Capital Rampart maybe? The Draconic Tree. Dude, the Tree Sentinel is not easy at first, that's for sure. Okay. This seems to lead... Oh, wait a second. That's where we need to be. Okay, this seems like... I'm hopeful here. That's a death trap. Can we? We definitely can't make that jump. They're just trying to mislead us. Let's travel in this way, I guess. We need to get up and right. Is this what's supposed to be the... No, this is where we entered, right? Okay, maybe we go around? Let me just go to the entrance and see for a second. So we're trying to get over there. Which 
Okay, is it possible from the this way? This is there's stairs. I mean, there's a downward route there. Does it? It leads to the cave that we've been to. I don't think that will lead to the bridge. Yeah, we went to the folk hero cave down there. It ended up being just the boss, like this area, the Ariza hero cave. I don't think it was accessible to go anywhere else from there. Like if I go here. I uh, know the mark just tells you where it is. It's not a teleport point. So here is the hero cave. Yeah, we've been here and it just leads us out to the side area, but I'll go look really quick. I shall go look. I, I imagine then we probably have to go into the city somehow. This looks like it's led by somewhere in the city. Maybe we can go to the balcony one. Yeah, I was thinking that it's um, Avenue Balcony and then maybe through the city. Let me just look out here really quick though. Uh, yeah, we did kill the we killed the boss in front of the beast sanctuary. It was just like the golem thing, right? Maybe we can we can jump from Margaret. That'd be interesting. We can go take a look at those two points and see. We are trying to get basically there, right? Yeah, we want to be up on that here. Kinda looks like you could. Okay, let's go look at the Margaret spot, and then from there we'll go somewhere else, if it doesn't work out. Okay, this is where the boss fight happens. Can we... Can we dip left somewhere? I know, we're gated in here. We just killed Margot again, yeah. <laughs> this is the real Margot. Oh, potential? Potential right there. That's kind of heading the right direction, right? That has potential. Yeah, the avenue one might be the closest, depending on what I can look at from out here and jump to. Let me just see. Yeah, we're definitely a lot higher when we're here than where we need to be. Okay, we'll try the avenue one. I might be on the right roof. Ah, yes. This could be it. There's where we came from. We can go up here. Straight led us to the city, but... There are stairs leading up. If we can just get higher. Oh, wait. That leads to where we've been, I think. So we would go this way, maybe? Oh, wait. I did open that giant gate at the beginning of this area. Do you remember? That's probably where we're going. Because I haven't searched that area because it kind of left the city. Ah, yes. This is probably the way. Now I remember. Yeah, we already opened this. Nice. Okay. Thank God for exploring earlier as well. I wouldn't have thought about this. This, yeah, this is going to lead us the right direction. Nice. Oh, not, not the bird things with their weird machetes again. Why are they even here? Is that a map? Oh, no. Two for one. Okay, one for one. Beast blood? Okay. Wait, what? I, oh, we got another one of his weapons. <laughs> we can go up, but if we can also... Search, no, we're going to search everywhere. Up is obviously the right direction, but... There are gifts here. What is this? That is not a lootable one, I guess. Hang on. Took me one hour to find this door. I had to... I, 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 like, I opened it when we first came here, and I was like, that leads out of the city. I wouldn't have thought about it right now without that... So many dogs. 
I love how even late game they have dogs because they know everyone hates dogs. <laughs> Who doesn't hate the dog enemies in these games? To be honest though, if you're not fighting a pack of them, they're not too bad. Because you can just shield and then kill them, but... Like a pack is the worst. Absolutely the worst. Oh, you didn't die from one hit. Lightning proof dried finger. Nice. Uh, I am level 109 right now. There we go. Okay. I'm being cheated out of my possible chest. So sad. I could be looting these flowers, I guess. Dogs are the reason I still use a shield. Oh my god, imagine pairing these two together. He's already an annoying boss. And you have a dog beside him. He's the most annoying boss. Because he's crazy. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> now they're just throwing bosses at us as regular enemies. Now we gotta go kill him. Dishonest random boss. It's actually the boss at the bottom of Limgrave, if you remember him. Oh, there was no grace point near there? Are you serious? Oof. Standard Dark Souls, what was once a boss is now an enemy. Damn, dude. You know what? We have a chance for this now, though. Let's see how much defense we get from that. He, dude, he's better than Margot. It's 100%. No, probably not. I just happened to run into him, hit a wall when I was trying to roll back. Sometimes the surroundings will get you killed just as much as like anybody's AI. Whoop. Wow. I, well, there's ways. I mean, so th I think the reason they said that it might be a little bit easier is you don't have to fight any of these things, technically. Like, they're not, like, stopping your progression, like a lot of the bosses. So, that's why they said 50% or more of the bosses are not... You don't have to fight them. We just choose to. Yeah, that's true. Dark Souls didn't really do that. It would have been cool if they did, to be honest. Here's a random Yorm just walking around. Would have been difficult, but it would have been funny. Okay, let's pull him without the dog. Or you know what? We could sneak up and just blast the dog and him at the same time. That sounds like a, a win for me. That really didn't kill the dog. Are you serious? Oh my fucking really? The whole point of that was to kill the dog. Okay, we're good. He's the most annoying because he actually has moves that straight up roll catch, not just hit. And this, like the surrounding area here sucks. Oh, he's weak though. Oh, I thought he was going to have way more health. He doesn't really give you a chance to heal though. That's his thing. So they made him hyper aggressive with zero HP. Okay. <laughs> My shield doesn't have a parry. <laughs> That's the weapon art because I've been using it. But dogs are a menace when they're near shit like that. Oh, yeah, no problem, guys. There's the stats on the right. Yeah, the hitbox is really precise on most of the AI. I haven't really... I mean, to be honest, in Dark Souls, I don't get clipped by a lot of weird hitboxes in Dark Souls 3 anyway. PvP is different because, you know, ping, but uh, PvE, they're pretty tight. This one seems even better, though, to be honest. Feels like the hitbox is only on the sword, like... Ooh, what's over here? Item, random enemy. Oh, these things. You guys were once terrible. Now you're not much. 
to me, this is the best so far in terms of Souls games. Yes. They kept a lot of the Dark Souls 3 movement formula. Um, they added a giant world. The boss fights are pretty sick. What is this? Thank you. Let's go this way. Why? Weird. It's praying, and I interrupted its praying. Ooh. Smithing stone. Nice. Another one. Oh man, dude. Not with a perfumer. That's gonna be straight cancer. Actually, you know what? We're just gonna go full aggro on him and just. Whoa! This one's stronger than the other one by quite a lot. What is that damage difference? Nope. Why exactly do I do so much damage on the second one and not the first? That was really weird. <laughs> I must have, like, only clipped him with the magic on the first one. There we go. Hello, Perfumer. Let's just do something. Oh, there's more. Oh, damn. That's a lot of damage. You die. You die. Perfumer dies next. And then birdie. I can't lock onto birdie. Get down. I didn't even know this guy existed. <laughs> All right. What a pain in the butt. Hey, Spitz! Thank you for the membership, man. What do we need more? Health boys? Yeah. Why not get both? <laughs> Health and FP. Okay. Let's get that going. Some exalted flesh. The Nassant butterfly. No, I just like the way the shield looks on my back. It looks... Wait, what? There was another one? Thank you for the membership, man. But no, it's just it's just there to look nice <laughs> and block when I need it. Um, let's go look over here quickly before we go anything. So we started. Okay, making good progress. Mmm, exalted flesh, my favorite. Elevator call. Elevator lever. This is a really cool elevator. Are those all different ways that I could possibly walk? No, they're window cells. Okay. The, the great FPS hitbox is so tight. I know, I felt that. Some of the thrust weapons, you really have to be like aiming it. Excuse me. Oh, is this? Oh. Is this where we have to go to get the talisman? Oh. Man, that really looks like it should have been down there, though. That's the tower. I'm confused, but all right. One. There's a horse in there. Is that Tree Sentinel 3.0? <laughs> Wait, Flame Drake. Do I not already have that? Plus one. I already have it plus two. Really? How were you not doing anything until that moment? I want my health back, so you're going to have to stop. That's not a tree sentinel. Okay. Things are looking a little up. Anyone hiding? But oh, ha ha ha! There was a knight hiding on the left. Actually, from what I've seen for the PvP backstabs, they did change it since the network test. I've also experienced it on the uh, NPC invaders. Before you wouldn't land a backstab at all. I, I've been able to land backstabs. It is a little tighter though, but. It's not as bad as the network test. I've seen people land back steps. Um, okay. 
but we'll see. We'll see how they how much they changed it. Sparkle! Sparkle bug. Do I have access to my horse? No. Sparkle bug, no escape. Oh, you're still alive. Wait, what? What in the hell? Oh my god! It evolved! Uh, it's fighting back! Wait, Heracross! Stop it, Heracross! I'm so confused. Smithing stone plus six. Okay. Stole my loot. It tried to steal my loot anyway. <laughs> I hope this rune is better than the other ones. I swear Radon's isn't that good. Compared to the first uh, Margaret one. Or, sorry, uh, wait. Okay, we go up first, I guess. We're going down. <laughs> I thought we were going up. Uh, okay. Spooky? Very foggy. No secret loot. Wait, maybe this was the way that brings us to the next area. This is definitely the next area. We're going back up on that bridge. <laughs> There's snow here. Um, yeah, let's sit and we'll go back up. Keep the progression nice and clean. And you accidentally find the next area. Oh, lantern, true. It's kind of foggy though. Oh no, the light's pretty good. It is beautiful. I love, I love the art style they chose. It's very nice. Okay, so we came in that way. We did not go this way. First, let's go towards, is that heading towards? Ah, yes, okay. That's looking like a divine tower if I've ever seen one. Capital outskirts. You for real thought Margit? The first Margit? Oh, it's dark. What's happening? Thank God for my lantern. Where the hell am I? What? Is this like Forever Abyss? Oh my God, you guys are just like the, the sewer enemies. Oh, that's gonna be decent for me. <laughs> Decent for me. Stand up, peasant. You know nothing of the ways of the katana. This just stuns me so well. Okay, you're dead. That's very bright. Why is this one just hanging back? Oh, you're the more powerful brother. Oh, yes. You spit the flames of demise. Oh, no. That's the homing soul mass. Those do more damage than the ones we fought before, though. Honestly, it's a little disorienting when you're, like, in the black. I can't, like, space properly. <laughs> it's weird. Get our blue juice back here. Other one. Aw, oh, you hit me. Ooh. Spit the flames. It's pretty cool though. Wait, don't explode. Oh, that's bad. That's ass. I didn't know that fully exploded like that. Oof. Okay, we're chilling now. Front flip. That means I can backstab you. Oh. Goodbye, fell twin. Not bad at all, not bad. Oh, yo, it's crazy up in here, though. Yes. I actually like that boss room. That was cool. Is this where I was just standing beforehand? All right. That was random. Didn't expect it. I'll take it. 
GG. Also, Spitz, can you show your stats real quick and what level is your katana? Uh, it's level 9, but it's a special weapon, so I guess it's technically the same as if you had a plus 18. And my stats are on the right right there. Up, oh, that boss room is pretty cool. Thank you, though, man. I appreciate the support, homie. Alright, so we got the grace point, and let's just sit at it. Wait. Oh, this is the East Atlas Gate. This is the West? I wonder. There must be some other beast boss we fight for that one, then. Huh. Okay. That is misleading. I wonder what we're going to be doing with the tower down below then. Must be another market somewhere. You're not wrong. <laughs> That's a possibility. Uh, no, I mean, it's not a waste at all. So, like, imagine you had 50, 50 dexterity instead of 50 intelligence and you were using a 50 dex weapon. What's the difference? Nothing. There's just certain weapons that scale off int. I could have magic, but then I'd have to invest more mind, which would not allow me to have 40 dexterity and 50 int while staying, like, kind of relatively not at a ridiculous soul level for, like, PvP later. You know what I mean? I would probably just go, like, 60 int and less dex. Which I don't want to do, so this is kind of this is just like a melee based dex int build. There's some weapons that benefit from that, while there's some weapons that are made just for intelligence, not dexterity, like the Moonlight Greatsword. Let's say you'll benefit from using that as a wizard more than this katana. All right, we go up. There's a grace point here. That's misleading. Very strange. What's gonna happen when I hit this grace point? Alright, we hit the great room. Margot's great rune. Okay, what does Margot's do? So we got Radon's. Greatly raises maximum HP. Now, what was... Wait, we're not runed up right now, are we? We're not. So we could technically try it out just to try it out, right? Let me look at my stats and I'll know if we're ruined up. Yeah, we're not ruined up. Okay. Well, we're kind of at the soft caps of a lot of things right now. So, we could try it. Let's see. What's my HP right now? 1258. All right. Fifteen sixty-two. Yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty healthy. It's definitely more than the five levels would give. Um, I check Moonlight Greatsword scaling. It's uh, mostly intelligence with D and strength and uh, dex. Now that might get better as we level it up, but it's still inherently more int based for sure. It does cost frostbite, so I like that a lot. I'm definitely gonna level into that eventually and level it up. Um, I guess that's all we have to do here. Hmm. Okay, so now the thing is, do we Volcano? Or do we Forbidden Lands? The Volcano is like a, a dark route though. I'm pretty sure if we join them, but based on what they've been, they're kind of what like the Dung Eater is. They want to kill other NPCs. <laughs> so I wonder if we do that, if we fuck up any of the quest lines, but... Well, we, we could do it. We could, like, start it, see if anything happens bad, and then continue. I guess. Screw it. Volcano? Yeah. So, I guess we got a Volcano Manor. Okay, actually, wait. Right before that, we're going to clean up our, uh, what's it called? Home base. So, before we say yes to them, I'm just going to go to the this place one last time. I don't imagine... We don't have many NPCs left in the regular route, though. They all, like, die or leave, and they're not in the round table hold anymore, so... Like, our profit's gone. Our blacksmith will probably always be fine to us. 
Let's go look at this really quick. We'll probably always be able to come here. I don't imagine it not being. Oh, I can offer a bell though. I have two bells. Yeah, what else do you sell now? Ooh. So regular smithing stones to four. Memory slot if we want it. Explosive stones. These are kind of cool. We could buy one or two of these just to have. Them. This guy is dead because we killed him, so. His rot is still here, I guess. We did kill him, though. Check the remembrances. Yeah, we need to find more of those turtles, though. I swear I've used all the possible turtles. Oh, there's a second shop. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that's just... Oh, there's a shop two now. I see what you mean. All right, so we're going to look at... Wait, what's bell shop one? Pop's bell. That was the guy that sold us the three spells. Roger's. Bell shop one is those two. Bell shop two is the black guard's bell. Oh, okay. So it's all the, the NPCs that would have sold us stuff. What is his, by the way? Oh, it's Raya's necklace. Okay. Okay, we must find more turtles eventually then. Um, anything else in here? Uh, you. What is it? What is it? Where should I go? If you're heading to the Forge of the Flame of Ruin, in the snowy mountaintops of the Giants, you'll need to find the Grand Lift of Rold, beyond the Forbidden Region. Or go if you would. Take no heed of Cardinal Sin. The <laughs> two fingers lost their purpose a long, long time ago. Okay. Well, I think that's it we have to do here, to be honest. We can go look at the woman with the two fingers. Um, I guess we could check on the blacksmith. The loathsome dung eater. So that door still isn't open yet. Well, I took you for dead. No matter. Lay out your I'm own. not dead. How dare you? This is still just for strengthening armaments. All right. And you're Pretend still just you here, for here for spirit tuning. No, I am not. I don't want to hug you again. Oh, shout out to this mirror, though, by the way. You guys can use it to reality or like change your appearance. So <laughs> I don't know if I've really done that on the stream, but it's there for you guys if you want to change the way your character looks. Dung Eater. Oh yeah, the real Dung Eater is alive. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> we killed the invader Dung Eater. Okay, let's go to the castle manor. All right, let's do it. I guess we got to. We got no choice. All right, we're entering Brave into your tarnished. services. Welcome. To Thank the you. Volcano Manor, I am Tanith, the proprietress of this house. Raya spoke well of you, a warrior of promise. Perhaps you are prepared to make a commitment. Will I am you now, join yes. us here at the Volcano Manor? Tied up all my loose ends. the burden of their grace, or be fooled That's by the cute. dogmatic ramblings of the fingers. Rise with us, against the Erd Tree. I guess so. Interesting. Your decision is most welcome. Now you belong to the Volcano Manor family. The drawing room lies down the hall. Make yourself comfortable, but be sure to earn your keep. I'm, <laughs> I'm like 30 hours in. I'm still jumping. The drawing room is through. Use the key. Whenever I'm accepting items. Okay. So we finally got a key, huh? Got to check all the doors. She said, let's check this door. Nice. Oh, you can't attack in here. Oh, this is because this is an NPC room. Wow. Oh, it's the girl who gave us the letter. I have no idea who that is. And this guy was in our keep originally. Ah. Huh. Oh, it, I've. It's it's you, is it? Didn't you say you well, were about to kill all I these guys? See you what happened? So you've been invited as well, I see. Then we're comrades in arms henceforth. You watch my back, and I'll watch yours. Nah, you are a traitor. I um. So I, am I, I guess though. You're wondering about Lanya. Well, you see, I... After much internal debate, I've come to realize... Revenge is not the answer. According to Lady Tanith, I've got the stuff of champions. And champions, ironic as it is, are oft forced to walk a tainted path. It hit me like a bolt from the blue. That my former thoughts were simple naivety. Of course my heart weeps for Lanya. 
That unfortunate incident was a cruel twist of fate indeed. But succumbing to the pain and sadness caused won't make me a champion, will it? Lanya knows this, I'm certain. Fate has laid hard roads for us both, but such is true of any road trod by champions. Okay. So we see now why he joined the manor. Ooh, letter from Volcano Manor. And a recusant finger. Recusant finger, not a key item. Thought it would be a key item. Must be a consumable then. Um, attempts invasion. Oh, oh, it's like the constant invasion. Do you how? So you have to join this to get that? Hmm. Okay. You. What in what heaven's are you? name are you doing here? The volcano manor is a pit of recusants who spit at grace and hunt our own kind. I hope you understand the weight of my words. Sure. Well, as long as you understand what you're saying. I thought you were tarnished bred by virtue. Perhaps playing that part led you to your doubts, I wonder. But know that the path you walk is blasphemy and leads only to a miserable death. Before you consider hunting any of your own kind, think on that. Okay. Hello again. Brave tarnished. I just want to straighten As a her. scout, I am pleased to see you again here at the Volcano Manor under Lady Tanith's guidance. She's always bowing. Brave She's so tarnished. respectful. Under Lady Tanith's guidance. May you tread. Okay. Um, let's see what other doors we can open then. Is this open from the side? No. Um, open this. That's just like another way into that room I see, but... That's not a door. Invisible wall. Can't attack in here. Maybe in the other rooms, though. Attack in here? No. Oh, I can break that. Ooh, that's something. There's gonna be some secrets in here, right? Check the letter. True. I was gonna read that after I went through all the doors. Uh, but that's the invitation. This is the regular one. Uh, old Knight Istvan. He can be found in Limgrave. Find the red mark on your map for the exact location. Ah, a tarnish that I have to hunt. I see. So this is the side questing. That's the regular quest, right? So he is here. I will mark that, but I still want to look in here. It's very dark in here, isn't it? Ooh, item. What? Does the item trigger? I can't attack in here. Why am I fighting? What? Can I attack in here? I can attack in here. Well, that's so weird. I guess when you grab the item, it opens the illusory wall. That's pretty good. But uh, I need a lantern. What the heck? But you can't. Okay, that's so weird because you can't attack in there. Um, lots of snaily boys in here. There's a, there's a way down there that I just saw, but there's also a gate. What do you think would be the progression? <laughs> Illusory wall. Okay. Ah. Wait, I killed both of those with that one hit. But there's still snail behind me. I saw him last second. Illusory wall here. I've got in the habit of just checking for those whenever there's tunnels. Oh, I was gonna say. Okay, whoa, hold up. Ah, uh, wait. Okay. There's still another way I could go though. Hold up. Oh. I actually can't open that door. There's just an item in here. What did that item say? I spam triangle too fast. Chat, I need your eyes. <laughs> Is this one? I already checked that, okay. There's layers on layers of tunnels in here. 
But we do have the other route we have to go as well. Down we go. I'm just like <laughs> curious at this point. Oh shit, one of the bloodhounds. Oh, okay. He seemed a little bit more bloodhound claw, dried liver. Oh, it was a cookbook? Okay. Nice. Wow, this is getting deeper. Hold up. No? Wait. Okay. Oh, a grace point. Okay. Oh, do all the quest lines first so you can't do them? Oh, that's a, see, that's a helpful tip. I'm down with that. That's not really spoilers to me. I, I would like to know that if I'm missing out on shit. Uh, okay, so... Um, I guess we go hunt the guy? Sure. Also, side note, I want to stop here and see what the Ashes of War this guy has. It was not a cookbook. Oh, what was it? Hang on. Is it a key item? Oh, I have so many larval tears though, side note. Holy. Yeah, we can look at the claws really quick. Here, I'll put them on before we do anything else. They should be in the fist weapons, right? Bloodhound claw. Can I two-hand them? Yeah. Wait. So when I two-hand it, my R1 becomes dual wield attacks. Weapon art. <laughs> oh my god. It's quick step, but teleport. Oh, Jesus. So wait, what if I were to hold my katana in my right hand and put in the talons on my left? I still get the stance, but I can two-hand my claws. I can't parry like this, though, because it goes to the right hand weapon art. That's pretty cool, though. Pretty OP. I, I, I see some dangerous things happening with that, but yeah. Okay. Warmaster's gone. <gasps> Nani. I wanted to buy the excess ones. I think we bought all his stuff. Whatever. Cause that was, are we hunting him? I feel like that was his name. Ish something, right? All right. Well, whatever. We go. We go down the tarnished path. Why are there a billion wolves? Like, what in the hell did I just hear? Okay. That was so many wolves. Elden Ring is amazing. Is it good? It's godly. I love this game. Wow. <laughs> oh, okay. I was going to say my mark's right on it. What are the odds? But... There was a sign. <laughs> oh, we're going into his world, I see. All right, I guess we're doing it. Oh, wait, this isn't even the same guy. We, we never even met Ritz Irvin. I want to see how backstabs will work. On like an NPC type humanoid, now that I'm thinking about it. That might do a lot of damage though. Okay, maybe we'll, we'll cool it for a second. That's really weak. Oh! I kind of snapped into me. Okay, well, Irvin dead. There's a hair on my hand, I see. So we got the rune arc and a finger fur calling remedy. Um, that wasn't the guy that sold the weapon arts. Thought it was. Oh, we got armor though. Scaled Greaves armor. Not bad looking. My set looks better though. Okay, well this looks pretty clean. I can't I cannot deny that. That's not that's not a half bad looking armor set. Kinda matches with the with the helm a little bit more here. What's the absorption difference here? 29? 30. 32. 
Ah, uh, this looks pretty good too, actually. I don't know. I like both of them. What's over here? Yeah, that looks a little bit better. I thought it looked worse at first. <laughs> My bad. Okay, I guess we warp back to the volcano. Um, all the way over here. Jeez. Volcano Manor. No, we're not. The head. The head is not. <laughs> The head is not coming off. The hat stays on with Dex. Did you read the letter left for you? That I is did. the task the Volcano Manor desires you enact. You will be compensated once the deed is done. If you are loath to hunt your own kin, so be it. But you must leave this house at once. This is a war against the Erd Tree. We have no place for the meek, nor the luxury of Oh, they're trying clean to kill hands. the Erd Tree. So is Melina. Hmm. Maybe this is You've really the good route. <laughs> I am pleased. Now you are a recusant true, and a full-fledged member of the Volcano Manor. This is your reward. Magma shot. Never forget Could I get some, that um, the recusant fights things. to tread the path of the champion. The way is tainted, but for this very reason, it is the true path to valor. Okay, so we now get you more. are a recusant. I am pleased. All right, did we get another letter? I'm guessing we have to do this multiple times, right? We did not get. Oh, we, oh, we got the letter on the stand over here. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm, I'm smart. It's in here. Ah, there is another letter. Volcano Manor. Also. This so is... you've blooded your sword in the hunt. Then I shall introduce myself once more. Banal, a recusant just like you. Recusants have particular battle arts, styled to our methods of slaughter. Why not add some to your repertoire? Oh, he sells the ashes of war now. Or is, is it the same guy just looking very different? Well, this is different. I'll take eruption and assassin's gambit grants. Wait, what is it? Excuse his presence or presence at the cost of self-inflicting wound. Okay. Do you actually go invisible? Near invisibility. I wonder though, because we did fight that boss in the well. It, well, not a well, but a cave well, that legit was invisible. Until we meet again. Ah, wow, he looks so different, I guess. Yeah, okay. I always resented these hands. That but that won't be the case for long. They'll be darkened by grit once I've set out on the path of champions. The tale of House Hoslo is told in blood, after all. This guy has been saying that and he has done nothing. <laughs> Can I just... Okay, what's the other volcano letter? It is... Hang on, let me just stand for a second. Oh! <laughs> the, the sitting for hours. <laughs> it gets to you. Okay. Riley the, uh, Riley the Idol can be found in the Atlas Plateau. Find the red mark on your map. Okay. You read, Mark. Atlas Plateau. Is that in the... Oh, that's definitely in the cave down there area. So I got to go from here. Uh, No, not it wasn't a problem, Danny. It legit is invisible. There's like an assassin you fight that is meant to be invisible. You fight it like in a, in a little shallow water pit so you can see its footsteps. That was meant to be. Sedentary chase. Yeah, right there I was. Needed that stretch. Riley is a merchant. I'll probably get his stuff after I kill him anyway, right? I've never met him, so... This is the path we must walk. Or do we have to walk this path? Why are you here? We've been down here. Is it above? Oh, I thought it might be here. I'll still run this way anyway, because it's either here or it's like up to the left, and I don't think I can drop down. Where's the mark? I can't open the map, pain. True pain. 
damn it. That thing's still locked on to me. I need it to be unlocked on for me. Mark is exactly right here. Oh, did I? Okay, so it is down here, not up top. All right, back we go. What does this merchant sell? I can't believe I didn't find him. Hang on, I wonder if I could just Google it. Just see if there's anything important. What what if he's an important merchant and I Oh, is he just one of the regular merchants? I don't think those are merchants. They're always just named nothing. Yeah. That doesn't seem like any merchant I know of. Okay. Yeah, we're assassinating some things apparently. Cuz we get stuff out of it, right? So Fuck it. We fuck up, there's always new game plus. <laughs> it's fine. Just gotta learn the stories. Riley the idol. He's got a dagger, okay. And probably a very damaging crossbow, I would say. My wizard arts. Well, we're becoming more and more recusant. Rune arc. All right. And the fur calling finger. We only got a rune arc for that? That wasn't much. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, wait. Serpus vial. Black key bolt. Serpus vial. Is that a weapon? What did it look like? Clayman, Clayman's harpoon. I never noticed I got that. Int katana. It's pretty good, as you can see. Oh, it's a talisman. Damn, I can never tell by looking at it. Is it? Oh, you mean an actual talisman? Goddamn, my brain. Oh, there we go. Eliminates all sound made by the wearer during movement. Okay. So it's just the slumbering dragon crest ring. Pretty good ring, though. I'll take that over whatever he's selling. Okay, last one, I guess. We go back to the manor. Actually, uh, wait, how many people are we killing? I'm assuming three. <laughs> These quests come in threes. Or fours. Please don't kill all my NPCs. <laughs> I don't want to kill that many. I see you've performed another task for us. Here is your usual reward. The serpent bone blade. Now, perhaps the time has come to tell you. Of the, the Erd tree blessed the tarnished with Oops. grace. But it was all too meager in the face of the enormity of their task. The tarnished were forced to scavenge, squabbling for crumbs. Like the shard bearers vying for power in the wake of the shattering, our lord, indignant, has refused to scurry about, fighting over what miserly scraps they allow us. If the Erd Tree, and indeed the very gods, would debase us so, then we are willing to raise the banner of resistance, even if it means heresy. We at the Volcano Manor, under Lord Rikard, have sworn no rest until it is done. If you follow this heroic path, one day the Lord will see you. Oh, the Lord Rikard is who we're trying to fight as well, right? It cannot come a day too soon. Hmm, I think you kind of have to join this covenant then, right? If that, if this leads to fighting a demigod. If you follow, it cannot. So this doesn't seem like it's like an alt quest now that I think about it. Otherwise, how would you fight him? Maybe there's another way, I guess, but... Red letter. Ooh. Red letter. That's different. Oh, I should have hit L1. The pain. Uh, a written request from Volcano Manor disclosing the name of a tarnish to be hunted as the follows. Juno Hazelo, Knight of Blood. 
it can be found in the mountaintops of the giants oh that's where we're going so we physically can't go there yet um okay so this lines up with where we're going then is this that's the giant lift road and this is the volcano mana request okay all right i guess we where'd this guy go <laughs> this guy's gone now i guess we just press onwards huh the guy who switches sides yeah that was he was there uh we got another katana what's this one causes poison buildup oh it's a poison katana but it scales off of mostly dex so it's like a pure dex build and it has double slash as a weapon art i don't know if that's interchangeable or not we can check at the, the grace point um, 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 um oh that's the guy his name was juno haslow of House Haslow. You're right, you're right. I was so caught up in like where he was going to be. I, I was like, maybe it was an NPC we didn't meet. But yeah, that, that, remember, that makes sense. Uh, wait, I was going to look at Ashes of War as well. Um, Yeah, it seems like a lot of the katanas have their own weapon art. I don't think I can put a weapon art on any katana I have. <laughs> Do I not? Oh, I, did I put the Uchi katana away in my bonfire? I did. Okay. Makes sense. All right. Well, let's look at all the wondrous physic we have. We've been using this. What else do we got? Raises half of total FP. Nah, I would just reallocate another FP flask if I wanted. Temporarily boost stamina. Temporarily boost all damage negation. By how much? That could be good. Makes attacks more likely to break enemy stance. That is also pretty huge. Um, temporarily reduces equip load in mixed physic that would be random <laughs> just drink it pull out alito's hammer <laughs> exploding concoction slightly negates damage okay we could go with greatly was there a greatly that's also good too yeah i'll leave it for now until we're fighting a boss that it might be useful against let's go check on the other dudes we didn't talk to the the i was gonna say waifu but she's more of the bow she's just constantly bowing have you ever heard any strange sounds here at the manor something beyond the walls like breathing or slithering scales oh fie what am i saying it just is impossible i must be tired i think you hear things because there are secret doors you. in here a recusant through and through i knew you had it in you take this <laughs> Ooh, letter to Bernarl. A special invitation to mm. hunt some of the first tarnished who sat at the round table hold. Ooh, if I don't you know should I want accept, to do that. I'll next see you on the field of battle. So he wants me to kill the other tarnished like me? Bernarl. Oh, no, hell no. We are not killing the disciples of our waifu. I don't think so. No, no. No, no, sir. No, no. I'm not killing the disciples of waifu. What are you doing back here? Ah, it's you, is it? I'm terribly sorry. But would you mind giving me some time to myself? I haven't achieved anything at all thus far. Even though I've dirtied my hands time and time again, I'm still yet to achieve anything. Perhaps I am a fool after all. No. It's worse than that. As things stand, I've given up on the path of revenge and sullied the name of my house. What an easy mark I must have been. How did it take me so long to realize, honestly? There's just no end to my foolishness, is there? So this guy is regretting becoming... Perhaps I am a fool after... No, it's worse than that. What an easy mark. I guess. That's why we're hunting him later, question mark. <laughs> Killing those two gives you the bloody whole farmer, but does it ruin my Ronnie ending? I feel like we're going, or I don't know, we're kind of done her quest line though at the same time, right? Maybe it won't interfere with it if we kill them, but whatever, we'll go a little bit forward more anyway. So, um, I guess we go to the giant area. No loose ends, I don't think. We've done most things, we did that. We got the rune. 
Um, we need to finish these NPC quest lines on the side before we kill that area, because apparently that stops it. So, I guess we go to the giant area. Selen. I can go look at Selen. But... Oh, you know what? What what became of the the sorcerer that we gave the key to? I do want to go check on our, our NPCs here, though. Go hug your wife. I don't think she's in the tower anymore. We can go look, though. The sorceress is still here. This one. There you are. Shall we commence the lesson? Show Azur's sorcery. What's this sorcery, my apprentice? Ah, then you have seen Master Azure. Master Azure was a founding Glimstone sorcerer and my first teacher. A stern judge of men. But he must have seen something in you. You hmm. make us both proud. We can speak more later. My apprentice. Tell me your story. If you recall, I was exiled from the Academy of Rhea Lucaria. It was for attempting to restore the primeval current of Glimstone sorcery. The toothless pedantry peddled by the Carian royal family can rot for all I care. I want Glimstone sorceries that open our minds, unbound by terrestrial taboos. No matter what we give in return. My apprentice. I presume nothing. Teacher and student are not bound to tread the same path. But hear me out, my apprentice. I need your help to restore the primeval current of Glimstone sorcery. Perhaps this is a journey we could take together. I am down. Let's go. Wait, hang on. Let me think. Why would I want to pair with the Academy? I, I wouldn't. But do I lose access to reallocating if I do this? <laughs> That is my only fear. Uh, we did give the key to the other dude. As long as I don't lose my reallocate, I'm down with you, Selen. I'm down with you. No, no, I was thinking, like, why, like, I want to join her because why would I want to be with the Academy? You know what I mean? But we could do it because content. That is a good reason. Because content. Splendid. I thank you. This pleases me. It's been far too long since I found a fellow kindred spirit. You must have a fabulous teacher. Aren't you my teacher? <laughs> I need your help, my apprentice. Master Lusat is another founding Glimstone sorcerer. And like Master Azure, he was banished from the Academy. Now he languishes in prison somewhere. My apprentice, can you find Master Lusat? Oh my god. With this glinstone key, you should be able to cross the boundary that encloses him. <gasps> Is this finally the way that I can release? Oh my god, please. <laughs> I need him to restore the primeval current of glinstone sorcery. He's nigh a child of the stars. Such is his body now. Lead on... Lusat? After his expulsion from the Academy, I heard that Master Lusat returned to his home, a place called Celia in the eastern Caled Wilds. Uh. Thinking about it, I obtained the glinstone key I gave you from a Celian sorcerer. It wouldn't be too much of a leap to suppose he's still cooped up nearby. Okay, well we can try and go and release that guy After now. After his expulsion from the academy, a place called Celia. Celia is the, the village Wilds. in the eastern Caled Wilds. About it, it wouldn't be Would that be the sage that we've already met in the Caled Wilds? It probably is, to be honest. But we go check the person trapped down below really quick. <laughs> All right. Side note. What do you sell? I got a lot of money. I said I'd come back and buy shit eventually. What do you got? Nothing I want. Okay. Nervous? Yeah, maybe it's the same thing. Let's go check the... Where, wait, what direction is it? Okay. The sorceress that's stuck here with the ice on her freaking hands. But what if it's a one key and we free her and not him? Mm, let's just go see. <laughs> we'll see what happens. If it's not, I, maybe we have to free him and then he frees her and they have like a little mage meltdown and they like hug it out. Uh, I ran by the point because I'm s as smart as they come. 
I'm so vigilant. My eyes miss nothing. Nothing at all. Why does this thing always spawn here? That's getting real old. I've killed that thing like a billion times. I'm not killing it again. You? Still out here doing the same thing, huh? Alright, so yeah, that, that was a that was a no-go. Okay, but at least we have a destination. The Celia Village is here. You could just warp to Celia Understairs or Celia Backstreets. Let's go back streets. Back alright. Okay, sorry, had to do that. Alright, we go down. So he's where is he though? In a, I, I didn't see any hidden areas in here. What exactly was her dialogue? He's in the city in Celia. That's where we are. Trapped. Hmm. Guess we can horse around. Thought it might be that sage, but he wasn't trapped there. So. Something east of east was it east of the city? Not in the city? Uh if it's to the east of the city. Yeah, maybe the sage. That's what I thought. I mean it's another like Glenstone Sorcerer, right? Like It's not a huge jump to think any it is to the east. If not, I am marking this because that's also another place I've never been. Wasn't, uh, was there a door I couldn't open in the city? I don't remember. There was the three blue panel like locked doors that we got. Maybe the main part of the city. Hang on. Before we run to the sage, let's just check that room. Because, yeah, you know what? I'm vaguely remembering that there was kind of like a dead end that we couldn't access. Sort of. Forest on the east side, yeah. Okay, if it's not here, then yeah, it's to the east. Yeah, okay, that was, we got access to that after the boss fight, okay. Do I find the map size overwhelming? Well, not really. I don't play a lot of open wor like worlds, but I play a lot of Dark Souls games and they're kind of vague as it is with the NPC quest signs and such, so. It's like just like a bigger version of that, so it's not too bad to me. There's a lot to do though, and I kind of love it. And you don't have to do all the side quests and stuff. It's just, it's just fun to do more content, you know. Oh, ooh, ooh, that didn't hurt that bad, but it looked like it did. Okay, I also just want to check on this wizard here, in the Eastern Celian Wilds. Okay. <gasps> we found Waifu though. Oh, hello again. Something okay. about this place felt familiar to me, so I decided to pay a visit, hoping to find someone here, but I've only found emptiness. Perhaps before my departure, I needed someone to say farewell to. What, is that me? Well, never mind that. I must focus on my journey. I must stay strong. Hey, cool. Well, okay. I must f I must. Well, that was a, a nice little treat. I wasn't expecting that. East. East of the Celian area? The Celian wilds, huh? I mean, there's not much east of here, <laughs> to be honest. That's up on the hill, I suppose. Can we even get out there by, by the gates? Or do we have to go up the other way? I guess we could see if she. We got we got a follower. He wants to play catch. No way, buddy! I'm not getting poisoned. Hell to the no! <laughs> yeah, you know, maybe if he's there and she goes away, the NPC quest lines seem to change when you warp. That is true. 
Let's check it out. It's been pretty good. We've had we fought some we fought a really interesting boss. Fought a, a returning boss but buffed up. I don't want to spoil anything. <laughs> if you didn't watch, but Alright, let's look back here. Why is there sparkles near oh jeez. Near that blue cavern. I chose a really interesting way to go to the same spot that I was just at that I know how to get to. Why did I do that? Autopilot. Sometimes it happens. Okay. Let's go check it out. Mmm, horse, core. I dabble. They'll never take me alive, horsey. Oh, you suck. Have we ever been in here? I don't think so, but it wouldn't let us in here. This tower is just kind of here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I guess. I could have sworn it said in Celia. Those are two separate words. And it's the city, right? Oh, he does come back. Okay. What do you have to say about this? Ah, welcome. Why are you always sitting like that? That's creepy. How may I help? Millicent paid a oh, visit. Oh, you noticed, did you? Indeed, Millicent did visit this hovel of a home. It seems the memories eaten away by the rotting sickness yet remain, but faintly. However, she has no need of me anymore. No, she must embark on her journey and stare her fate in the eye. I mustn't impede. As I've aged, I've found the best way to aid the young is to be forgotten. Oh, he already bought all this sorcery. Okay, I guess that's all he has to say. Um, I didn't see a prompt for dialogue near this tower, but I'll go near it. Celia, town of sorcery. I see acquire materials. I don't see a talk option though. Oh Jesus, wizards. Ow. Can't you see this hat? She said Celia, in the eastern wilds. And I guess I'm in the I don't know. I guess I guess I'm in the eastern wilds, and this is Celia, so Yeah. Let's just peruse a little bit. Oh, I came here earlier. This is just a completely different quest line. I've already been here. There's a reason we have to be here now, though. We're looking for an imprisoned wizard, basically. Somewhere in the city. Town <laughs> of. Yeah, there's a lot of gross things going on here. That's for sure. And wizards. Now, was there a... We have a key, so... Was there a point at which we needed a key that we didn't have? It's hard to tell when some of these doors just aren't doors, you know what I mean? Is it in the city? You know, I feel like... I don't remember a door I couldn't unlock though. Oh shit. Yeah, we can read the description of the key, I guess. Whoop. Uh, Celia, town of sorcery, can be found in Kiela. This key was said to have been found in possession of the Celian sorcerer, capable of breaking the seal that keeps Master Lusat confined. Yeah, so it's in the city. Um, the light, I did those candles. Oh my god, no way. He's not in the city, even though it tells you he is. Okay, I'm just gonna go by here really quick. I mean, yeah, that there's three towers. We already did that, though. That's a different challenge. Well, not a challenge. There's a thing you do to get items, but we're gonna go up here. Let's see. After we went up here, there was an area up top, I suppose. Let's just sit. Yeah, I, I know it said the city for sure. 
It did say that. Because this is Celia. Now, I imagine he's hidden, though. Or somewhere that I've never been in this city. There's a church here. We can maybe get a bird's eye view above the city area. Yeah, he's definitely maybe at the top of that area of the city. But where's the city? It's here. Just want to like look from above. So definitely in there I guess there's really nothing else around here where you would be locked up he's in that city unless that tower is something <laughs> I doubt it though yeah that's what I was thinking around the church might give us a hint we could also cross let's just go look over there I don't think I've even been over there regardless so I want to I want to go over there Not all the bats. Not the bats. They are the worst. Item? My senses were tingling. Bye, bat. Yeah, for some reason I never traveled this way. Why did we not travel this way? There could be loot here. There's a giant, but the giants don't give us anything. It's so sad. I got one of their swords one time, and I killed like 20. Um, okay, that just leads down to the regular area. I see why I didn't go this way. Dude, honestly, the bats and the, I agree, and the hawks are terrible. They're just like the worst enemies. I hate fighting them. Yeah, you can heavy attack and backstep, but only certain weapons, by the way. So if you're trying it with all weapons, it won't work. It's just like rapiers, curved swords. Um... Wait, have we been here? We have been here, okay. Okay, so it's not here. It's definitely in the town. Alright, we go do a deep dive of the city, I guess. That is rough. Yeah, it's a little far. Oh, okay, so this is the entrance. Part of the city is here as well. Yeah, that is true. This is still part of the city. Okay, now we're in Swamp of Aeonia. Oh, there is a back path there, though. Hold up. I don't kill all enemies, but a dog, we kill the dog. Let's just look for... Yeah, I was thinking it might be like a secret door. There have been some illusory walls throughout... Some of the NPC quests. Also, there's a dungeon here. Did I ever do that dungeon? Hold up. We've never been in here. Celia Crystal Tunnel. Um, well, we may as well do this while we're searching, because... Yeah. Okay. No harm here. Go loot the cave. It's probably got good things for us anyway. It's a crystal cave, so... Crystal cave means crystal things, means int. Yes. Fake wall. Not a fake wall. I was baited. Woo! This looks like it's gonna be fun for wizards. Oh, those things. I actually despise those things more than anything. They were like everywhere in the Scarlet Rod area. <laughs> My least favorite has a bit weird death sound too. Lots of stones here, yeah. Crystal. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You. Oh, wow, what a deke. Little deke artist over there. See a pathway over there. Oh, ah, oh. ah, 
Almost. <laughs> Damn. Okay, I guess we have to go around there some other way. What's this? Gravity stone fan and gravity stone chunks. Oh my. Oh, you would fall all the way down. Oh wait, uh, you know what? That was a good fall. I didn't see these smithing stones here. I'm all for this. Flintstone scraps. Whoop. Oh, this is where one of the teleport chests leads to. That's hilarious. That's so deep in the Kaled area. Wow. Is that the one that I rolled out of? Oh, another rune arc. Nice. That's how I got here. Oh, okay. I guess it was then. We had prior been talking about mimics, and then I opened a chest and like smoke emitted around it, and I just rolled out of sheer like habit. So I guess I avoided the teleport. Okay. Whoop. Guess we. I don't know. There's some other way to get there, I suppose. Um, did we go in here yet? We didn't. Oh, there's something behind here, though. Stone key plus five. Okay. Let's go up top. I still hear someone digging as well. Do you hear that? Oh, yeah. There's definitely a way to get up there. There's ledges. There's a ladder there, too. I hear someone digging. There is an enemy. Um. Oh yeah, we can go over there. I see, I see. We could jump here, and then jump here, and then jump in here. Oh, yes. Parkour. Nice. I knew I heard you. Yeah, nice. Wall? No wall. I hear crawling around still there. Let's go. Whoa. Cave? Fake wall. <laughs> These caves, man, they always have secret areas. Whee! Smithing stone plus four. All right, I gotta keep jumping in mind in these caves always. Okay, that's gonna shoot some weird shit at me, but it's okay. Or it's gonna, what is that? That was like a weird texture or something, I don't know. It's not like a wall. Ooh, there's actually a lot in this cave. Rock blaster? Look like a spell. Ooh, thrust staff into ground to emit massive shockwave. That sounds pretty cool, honestly. One, that sounds pretty cool. Definitely get up there somehow. Yeah, ladder. Okay. And that's where we... W oh, I just... Wait. Is that where we were? It is, but there's like more to it than where we were. Um, okay. I guess I've been hearing that guy all along. This looks fake. It is not. That is a real wall. Uh, items? But there's more there. Hang on, let me just see if maybe there's a... Grace point? This is actually a pretty deep cave for... Where you guys can get warped at the beginning. What the hell? Yeah, we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back for sure. Get the shortcut. I wasn't sure if that was just like a dead end, but no, that's a much deeper part of the cave. Whoop. And so we can come back up easily, right? Yeah, sweet. I wanted to just jump and see what this guy's doing. Um, oh, a whole bunch more crystals. Yeah, wait, is that crystal? No. 
Some more cracked crystal right there for us. Whoop. Got this going on. Let me go back. Uh, yeah, that's not a fog wall, I guess, or a fake wall. What was in the area where the guy jumped out at us from? He was in here. Okay. Guess he was just like a jump scare, not guarding anything. Oh, there's more to go that way, too. Jeez. I think this is going to backstab. Oh, they can. They're so, like, narrow, I wasn't sure. Faithful Canvas Talisman and Faded... Wait, no. Talisman is here. Faded Flower one. It looked like that, didn't it? Yeah. Faithful Canvas Talisman. Raises potency of incantations and... Okay. So it's for buffing miracles. Cool. This is where you get the miracle buff, even though it looks like an intelligence cave. That's, that's a little different. Definitely different. And there's definitely a boss in there. I agree. There always is. Oh, oh no, not him again. Oh, he's so much weaker. He's, he's like but a mere peon of the real version. Still, okay, maybe a little bit more annoying to fight in a cave though. Didn't really think about that. Oh no, it, it won't be that bad. out of that here. Ooh, it's basically the whole arena. <laughs> At least the other one was a bit smaller. Oh wait. Oh no, we're he's dead. He is dead. <laughs> Sombers Moon Stone 6, regular 7, Gravity Stone Chunk, Gravity Stone Chunk, and a Minor Bell that we can give to the merchant in our shrine. Alright. Let's go just do a little bit of backtracking. See if we forgot anything. Ooh, yeah, we did forget a stone. Look at that. Always pays to go look back. It really wasn't a, a wall, huh? Strange. Uh, well, we are, we're doing the volcano questline for Taz, so we have to do it in the giant area. We're just completing another uh, side quest. This, I swear this looks like an illusory wall. I guess that's it. Oh, wait a second. Did we go over there ever? That looks like somewhere we've never been. Oh yeah, no, we've been there. We came from there. Okay. Yeah, I guess that's it. Okay. No more secrets. I am very upset. It looks like a fake wall. It doesn't get more fake looking than that. Okay. So... This didn't end up being where we needed to go, though. <laughs> Sadly. Oops. Oh, my build? Yeah, no problem. There you go, guys. There you go. Oh, we killed the boss there. There are so many illusory walls, though, now that I, like, think about it. There are a lot of them. Did it get more purple out here? What, what, what is... Is it purple at night and I've just never been here? I guess. This is weird. Okay, so we're back in Celia. 
Mm. Okay, let's go check above. There's the church area that we can look at. There's above here. Cause it, we've been all over that town. We've been here like so early. The music's different too. Hmm, maybe we did something. Oh my god, hang on a second. Okay. Okay. Looking for as we're looking for a sorcerer trap somewhere. Yeah, what the hell this is really weird. <laughs> that was a skeleton rising. Oh my god, all right. Maybe just nighttime changes this area like that. Oh wait, the ball, the ball. Oh boy. At least it hurt the horse and not me. We could ask the, the shack. Oh my god. Okay. There is like guards up at this church, I guess. It's not in the city. Why would these guys be guarding? Who is it? Uh, who actually imprisoned him? That's a better question. You know? Who put the sorcerer in jail? Um, yeah, we tried the lady sorcerer actually. It wasn't her. So somewhere in the city, town, area. I've gotten this grace point. Oh no. Would we get a cue if we got near it to like activate our key? No, they specifically told us to come here. So to the east city of Celia. So, this is the east. Fire materials, what's this? Looking like a possible well entrance. <laughs> I don't know. Tree, possibly? That it's hidden? Maybe there's more to this area? Like, I've never. Okay, you know what? There's a skull right there. And the hill leads there. I don't think I've ever really gone to the skull. Let's go to the skull and see if there's like. Maybe that's the prison. Who knows? <laughs> Looking very suspicious. There's even like a wind jump there. Oh wait, I think we went on the skull before, yeah. We have been on here. I've been up top here. You're right, you're right. I remember getting the items. Okay, so it's probably not this far from the area. Maybe it's... Is there like a cave line here? Where does this lead? That looks like a lava pit, but... Um... Hmm. That HP bar? Yeah, we're using a... A rune, a great rune that does that for us. Um, that's death. Hmm. You say the wall had. <gasps> what the fuck? Who in the fuck? Who did this? Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Who is finding this? The 
They weren't lying though, east of the village, but like what? Kind of nonsense? That is ridiculous. <laughs> okay. What in the nonsense? That's crazy. Yeah, I, I was for sure thinking the skull, but it's a little bit too far to be considered. Like, it was up here. I would have thought... I mean, this doesn't even lead you there. That's crazy. That's actually crazy. What? We've seen some really weird, like, illusory walls. Some that I, you know, I wasn't sure on. I just attacked for fun. But, like, that one... That was long shot. That was some bullshit. What the fuck? Okay. What? Oh, this is the crystal cave you see in the, like, artwork. All right. This is still part of the crystal cave, I guess. Because these guys are still working. Oh, yo, I'm attacking every wall I come to. That's a dead end from now on. Like, after that? I don't know, man. <laughs> There's dead. Uh, yeah, of course. Anytime I... Like, especially the sounds. At least the sounds can leave you. But, like, Wow. Hunter of illusory walls. This is where the picture is taken. Wait. Ah, I'm gonna just do some cosplaying real quick. Ah, yes. Yes. Yes, hang on. Ah, yes. I'm gonna nail it with me in it instead. Better. <laughs> Okay. More illusory walls? No, maybe. Uh, on the crystals we go. Before we drop down. Is this a choice we have to make here? Because if I go there, I, I'm not going to be able to go right. But if I go right, I can come back. There's a pillar above me. The correct path is right. Nice. That's a gap. We jumped that. Out of the way, snail. Snail number two and Gary number three. That, that leads back here, I guess. Okay. No, this is optional. These are all like optional quest lines I'm trying to do if I find them. Um, wait, what's this way? A way back and a way there. Wait, that is this where I came from? I'm a little lost. I have a Glowstone. I came from. <laughs> I got kind of all jumbled up. This feels like it's where I came from, to be honest. It's not where I came from, okay. We're going weird routes. This place is actually pretty huge. I had like three different like options. Anything up here? That's suspicious. They're like snake scale or snails, I guess. I swear. This place is actually really big. We can branch back to that main like three area way. Like there's a lot in here. Oh, item. Crystal darts. Okay, we'll, we'll continue down this way because the other way I can still go as well. 
You laugh if the Crystal Sage was in here. Yeah, me too. Oh. Oh, okay. Nope. Not that way. Oh, I found the boss early. Uh, oh, well. We can fight it and then just hit backtrack. I guess. Why so many snails? You know what's really cool? I actually have decent absorption to everything in here. Oh, these things suck, and now there's three of them. You gotta be joking. On the bright side, no, not there's no bright side here. I'm trying to be optimistic. I think I have really good defense. For them. Oh, I crack them quick. Never mind, this might be okay. Let's get healthy quick. He's cracked, so now he's gonna die rather easy. Then we gotta work on cracking the other two. Okay. We need the FP back though. Nice. We don't really need to waste any more FP on this guy. Scarlet Rod. Shit. Okay, that mage in the back actually is more annoying than you'd assume. But you need to sit down. I'm tired of your shit. Okay. Now just you, wizard. Now I of course. You know, the Scarlet Rod definitely hurts. We got one more FP slashing us. Just enough to crack them. Perfect. Nice. Not bad. Crystal Torrent. The crystal version of our horse, apparently. <laughs> no, but I wonder how much uh, FP or int that requires. It needs 47 int. Damn. Okay. That's a pretty high requirement. Uh, do I want to go back out? Or do I want to continue and look at what we did? Might be easier to actually backtrack from the beginning of the area. Then go all the way back up. Yeah. Torrent would like a word with me. <laughs> okay, we're gonna use the healing one. Yeah, we're gonna go back in, of course. We have to for the the quest line, but I just wanted to oh, let's put our lantern back on too. Put our lantern back on. Celia hideaway. Uh, let's see. So we went down to the left the first time, correct? So now we need to jump down a little bit differently. I don't really need to kill all these guys, but we're doing it. Yeah, we came here. We went to the right because we could come back. Now we can go this way. Really? That... Okay. I could jump onto this and go back to where we were, I guess. But we could also... Go down. And there looks like there's a fun thing awaiting me. Oh, yes. My favorite enemy. Do you recall this one? Yikes. Hey, wasn't that OP this time? He's been stronger. I can't trust the wall anymore. You really can't. Why do you think I'm out here fighting every wall I see that looks a little bit flat and suspicious? 
<laughs> okay. Item. Smithing stone. And this leads us back out and where are we now? Okay, we've gone here, right? Yes, we went to that side. I don't know if I gapped to that side. Oh, I do remember these things though. Oh yeah, lost ass. Of, uh, lost ass of war. Yes, lost ash of war. You used to. Uh, wait, have I been down there? Is that where I was earlier? You used to duplicate uh, ashes of war, so you can have more than one. I can't tell if that was the way we dropped down before, or is that a dead thing in that crystal? That looks suspicious. I'm gonna go that way. Is that a sorcerer in a crystal? Is that what that is? That's crazy if so. It's a dead body. It's a dead body. It's not. It's not a sorcerer encapsulated in crystal. <gasps> but I did find the way. <laughs> Thank you, dead body. I appreciate you. Peasant. Oh my god. Used Cellian Seal Breaker. Wow, okay. Wow, he's looking big. Star is a ruin. Is that it? I mean, that's cool. I just wanted him to, you know, get up and come with us. First 12 dark shooting stars that pursue foes. Oh, fires first. English. I don't speak it. I guess that's it, huh? Then we go talk to Selen, I suppose? Doesn't look too good, but he taught me one last thing before he, he heads on out of here. Hmm. That's, I guess that's it, huh? That's the end of the quest, okay. I know, right? I'm like a little bit suspicious of like illusory walls, but I also don't want to hurt him. Let's go take one more clean look at his room. Nah, there's definitely not one here. That'd be weird. I just, no, I don't want to hit him. I don't think so. Um... Okay, so we go back to Selen, I guess. Wait, where are we? We're east. This map is huge sometimes. Um, Selen is here. Okay. All right, Selen, what do you got to say for me when I bring back shooting stars? My apprentice. Give me a moment later. I have a favor to ask. Okay. The form you see before you is merely a projection. Oh my god, finally. My body lies elsewhere. But the academy shackles prevent it being moved. My body is on the Weeping Peninsula at the southern tip of the lands between. You don't know how long I've waited for this. In the ruins just down from the church of Marika, past the plain of the wandering mausoleum. Can you make the journey to my body? I have something that I can only trust with you. Let's go. Wait, I already didn't I do this though? Who could have guessed? Oh. What a place to find Master Lusat. You have my gratitude. This is all your work. I am truly pleased to have you as an apprentice. Yes. And a kindred Praise spirit. Praise me more and my hat. This hatch. is a mere token of my thanks. What we get? Starlight shards. Got one of those. You know how many of those I found. Full step closer. Oh, well. The bodies of masters Azure and Lusat can be admitted to the academy. If only I could undo these wretched shackles. We will undo them. My body is on the Weeping Peninsula at the southern tip of the lands between. Imprisoned in the ruins just down from the Church of Marika. Can you make the I have some Okay. That's it, I guess, huh? All right, we finally, finally get to figure out how to free her, maybe. <laughs> finally, I was out there lighting torches near her hands, shooting her with crossbows in, her, in, in the ice, you know, in my defense. 
Tried a warming stone. Even brought a potion that I thought might work. <laughs> I was trying everything. Oh, it's the other way. Okay. Oh boy, that looks like death. Oh my god, we're good, we're good. It hurt, but we're good. Okay, hang on, hang on. I just know with my kind of luck, those things with spears... Oh no, they de -aggroed. Oh my god, that's the first. They'll come wandering down here and hit me. My apprentice. Thank you for coming. Oh, look, she's smiling. These shackles take a toll on us all. There is something I need you to look after. My primal glinstone. A star has fallen and my fortunes waver. Someone may come for my life. And so I entrust it with you. No! My Don't die. You're my sorcerer. <laughs> I gave you all the things. Oh my god. <laughs> Selin's primal glintstone. <sighs> Thank you, my apprentice. This is my essence. Please, treat it with care. Treat it what you hold is my very being. Okay. Treat it what you hold. And what are we doing with it exactly? <laughs> In essence, a primal glintstone is a sorcerer's soul. If transplanted into a compatible new body, Selin will rise again. Ah. Okay. You think she wouldn't tell me to go find a new body? Oh, yeah. There's things happening out here. Yeah, let's go back to the illusion, maybe. She'll tell us more. That's what I was thinking. All right. Back we go. Okay, we gotta find her a new body. Ah, Come on, Torrent, you're better than this. We must find her a body. I require a body. Oh, we're on the lower half. I was confused. Okay. Time for another illusion wall hunt. Well, we're getting good at those. <laughs> sort of. Better than the turtle. No, she's gone. I need hints. <laughs> oh god, okay. Um what other wizards do we have access to? The wizard wasn't really related, I guess. Let's rest and look and see what happens. Maybe Renala? Maybe we finally hang on. Whoa, hold up. What if we finally will find the guy? That's in the Ruc Raya Lucarian area. You know? Hmm. Let's just go look. The bed one in front of Lucaria. Yeah. Wait. Yeah, there was a wizard somewhere, right? The bald guy, maybe? Wasn't there one... Ah, is it thy Okay, Be she just is this. I would... I'd swear I saw one with the mask somewhere. What about the dead guy? I I don't I don't I don't think I think they need to be alive. What about Ronnie's rise? That's a good point. We could talk to Celevis. This guy isn't in the castle, I guess. We did look everywhere in the castle. So let me think. We got options we can go to ronnie's rise plus i haven't been back there honestly since we did the full doll quest we can maybe check celavis let's look at the second ronnie's rise yeah let's let's see what happens up here
in the middle of this way. No matter what might happen, Ronnie, oh, she needs me. Oh. Hang on. There's Ronnie quests. I'm double dipping now. <laughs> What? Why is Blythe evil? That's weird. Hang on. Wait, is this because of the other quest re request we have? Hold up. We have so many side quests happening right now. Vargram the Raging Wolf. Both men can be found at the royal capital of Lindell. Yeah, ooh, ooh. Do we want to kill him, though? I don't know if we should kill him. That, that might fuck the Ronnie ending, but he's kind of evil looking. Okay, maybe we won't do that. Not right now. Is the round table off limits right now? No, it's not. It's not. Oh, damn. The side questing. We got we got a lot to do here. So is that not Blythe? It seems like it's him. Oh, the note is not Blythe. Oh, I thought it was. Hang on, let me read really quick. Let me read. Oh, it's Vargram the Raging Wolf. An errant sorcerer Wilhelm. Oh. Okay, this is a this is a purpose. This is for Ronnie's quest line. Oh god, I guess we're meant to do this, huh? I guess so. I already killed Invasion. Oh shit, he's kind of strong. Hold up. Hold up. The Invader version of him did not have that. <laughs> That's a sick ability. Oh, he, he counters the backstab. What an ass. <laughs> okay. Take it. Oh, I was going to say, maybe he counters that as well. Stop it. Oh, shit. That's a powerful hit. Oh, God. I saw it loading up. Ah, ice. Okay, he's strong. And we can't stagger him. And just the backswing there. I can do. I can get in though, maybe with. Nope. Cannot get in there. This man is a beast. We, we can't really stun him. That's actually making it very difficult. Oh my God! His sword is godly. Okay, I got an EFP. I want to backstab that, but we can't. Maybe we can backstab the after. No. Magic Blast. Oh, fucking Jesus. Oh, my God, dude. He's ridiculous. <laughs> can we get the regen going? Holy shit. You can go so far with that lunge. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can stagger him. Yeah. Holy shit. Not to mention he does like about a billion damage per hit. Oh, there we did something. I think I bled him. Oh, there we go. Like eight weapons later. Jesus. Hardest NPC we fought by far. Royal Greatsword, Blythe's Armor, Gauntlet's Greaves. Jeez, he is a warrior and a half. Kind of cool looking. Can't deny. What's his sword? My god. It is a... Wow, a strength int. Cool. It could, what does it do? What do we lack? We lack a little bit of the strength. Whoa. <laughs> That's a pretty cool weapon art. My man's doing front 360s. I think he literally does a front flip in a 360. 
<laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, that's one of the cooler great swords that we've seen so far. In terms of strength, into that might be the coolest weapon for it. So we're gonna need a strength int build along with our dex int, it seems, because I like both of those. <laughs> Artorius, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we did that. That was un. I was that was random, honestly. Let's see if anything's at the top of the tower after we beat him, and then we can go to the other tower, I guess. It is quality in, but it has like a higher strength requirement, so I imagine it's gonna scale a little better off the strength. No, I, I see that, I see that, but usually, yeah, I mean, it's more strength. It's got E and Dex. Just because it has a little scaling doesn't mean it's like, but I guess we'll see. It could upgrade and have really good quality, but strength and inter are definitely more investment uh, focused for it. You want to see the full set? Okay, we're going to have to go up on the elevator anyway. We are blithe. We are fat right now, but we are blithe. Uh, it doesn't seem like it. Okay, let's go to the other grace point. Oh, wait. Ronnie's Rise 1, Ronnie's Rise 2. Okay, this is the Royal Moon Gazing Ground. Okay, we've been there. That's the boss. I guess we can take a, a journey to the other... This sword looks weird with this armor set. It doesn't flow. Should we look at the other towers? Let's go to Celevis really quick. Uh, yeah, I imagine we need to... Ow. You know what? We found a few hidden areas under here. There's a couple areas. Oh yeah, there was a secret path that we found in the ruins. Do you remember that? We jumped down. Oh, okay, well we gotta gotta find that again. But am I wearing the wrong chest piece? Oh, it's the crucible. I was like, why does this look less good? Jesus. <laughs> I thought I was like like having a brain fart. I was like, why does this look not as good as it did? Maybe after seeing Blythe's armor, I was like, huh. <laughs> that was a that was a good version of me being blind. Indeed, indeed it was. Let's go to Celevis quick though. He might say what, what exactly where we need to go. But I do remember there was a secret area here that we jumped down one time. I am a cowboy. Like I even got my version of the cowboy hat. Yes. <laughs> oh. Okay. Is this one Celevis? I always forget which one is which. Oh, this is Rena's. Ah, uh, would it hurt to look up? We'll go look anyway. Oh, that's the warp point. We've been there. Okay, so Celevis's rise is there. Damn, we took a the longer path. Yeah, we can check below, I guess. Is it? Would it be Ro yeah, Ronnie's Rise, I guess? There's Well, still, I want to see what uh, Syllabus has to say, though, in general. Just because, I mean, the part of the quest line. What if there's, like, a dark Syllabus as well? Oh, God, hang on. I'll save you guys from the invasion of the bots. Was I able to jump off here? Yeah, down this way. What? Be gone! Okay, this is Celevis's tower. Are you here, Celevis? I was late. Perceptors. The Perceptors long gown. What? Oh, we can use starlight shards to get puppets off his dead body whenever we want. That's a little creepy, but okay. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I don't just like, I, I don't know, I don't know why people like to do that. I mean, it's fine to test an invasion, go ahead, but I did play like 15 hours of invasions on the network test. But like, the first thing I want to do when I get a Souls game isn't just invade in it, what? But do you want to learn all the weapons, everything that it has to offer? <laughs> the people that spend like their first day invading, I'm always like confused by. I'm so excited to play the game first. PvP comes like after I've learned all that stuff, then I'm like, okay, now we just master PvP. That's always been what I did. Uh, okay. So I guess it's not here. I guess it is down in the room somewhere. That cowboy hat is worse than my current cowboy hat. Let's be real. Okay, let's go back to Ronnie's Rise, because that's obviously where Blythe was doing some stupid. I think there was more to his quest. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe we missed some of Celibus's quest. It's okay, though. Um. Yeah, I've, I've always done that, personally. Oh, wait, wait. This is just a shortcut to the bottom, right? We've, we've done this. Yeah. I, I, I almost thought that was a cave. Oh, what about EG? You're right. What if, oh, no, I like EG. He's my favorite blacksmith. Okay, let's check around here. There's definitely something in the area. Oh, the chick. Oh, because the hero girl didn't want to drink the potion. Right. I don't know how he would have forced her to drink the potion, though, to be honest. Hmm. There's a lot of ruins here. Damn, they have a lot of hidden stuff on this particular quest line, don't they? I wonder if it's like an illusory wall or... Wait, what is that? I just had like a message. Hmm. We are, we are off questing. We're doing really well with it, I feel like. Oh, that looks suspicious. A nice wall. Perfect height for a, a, a doorway. I hear a sparkle. <gasps> this is where it was! This is where it was! Remember we landed here? And we were... We dropped down here, right? Yeah. We did this. We've been here. There was a merchant in there. We took this exact route. Our merchant! Who the fuck are these guys? I can't lock onto them. This is weird. See, this thing's happening here. <laughs> nah, me. Hang on. What the? I'm even more confused. Nothing? He just he just died because of these knights? I can't attack in here. Okay, well, I guess this isn't exactly where we need to be. No, I can't swing at one. You can't attack in here. Now it's like a, a church place. Hmm, Chase, you might want to do something with that rune you have. Yeah, the, the key item one? Yeah, I know. I'm looking. I'm looking. This? You mean? Okay. Oh, 
I, I got the white ball thingy, did I not? I can I can attack here though. No, I don't think that's a cutscene. He was just dead. Something's happened. Yeah, it's holy ground up there, basically. Wait, was this? This is the path we came up. Yeah, okay. Oh, back to Ronnie's Rise. We found one secret. <laughs> uh, we need to find more. It was the Lord of Dung? I don't think so. All right, so there's a hidden place near here, huh? Hidden place near the ruins. Oh, we can check. There is a lot of ruins here to look through. I wonder if it'll be like super obvious. Uh, I tried a few twin blades, but not the basic one yet. This looks random. Hmm. We could pause this if we don't find it and continue on in, into the actual next area. I know, they all getting whacked off, dude. Why? Oh, there's a staircase here. What if it's like a secret staircase? In in the staircase. Oh, you mean my yeah, my runes. Shit, I forgot they're even called the runes. The turtles did it. Yeah, probably. After we took like 5,000 years to find them. Alright, we can continue this a bit later. Mostly because I want to go continue on the combat, I suppose. That was a lot of side questing, though. That was a lot of side questing. I just give the the rest of the runes here a once over, see if there's anything in particular that looks a little bit suspicious. Glintstone essence is used in the ruins near Ronnie's tower inside a hidden underground location that needs to be found by hitting the ground open. Oh Jesus, there's more illusory walls to this quest. Oh god, that's ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. Oh, we still have the four belfries Glintstone as well. Glintstone essence is used in the ruins near Ranny's tower, inside a hidden underground location that needs to be found by hitting the ground open. Illusionary stairs downward. Hmm. Okay, maybe we'll find that later if it's that hidden. Because we're in the ruins, but... Like, illusory ground? <laughs> that's, that's about as ridiculous as a flying turtle, but you know... After everything I've seen in this game, no longer does that sound, you know, not plausible. That's definitely possible. Wait, this looks a little bit suspicious. <laughs> okay, we'll just go continue the other area, I guess, and then come back to here. Don't give up. There's an item here. How are we supposed to find an illusory floor? I mean, this kind of looks like... Oh! <laughs> I have the luck of anime on my side, yes. This wizard hat leads me all. <laughs> I'm just a little dead because, like, I looked down and there was, like, a trace of a door, you know? Uh, it just, it looked so perfect. Oh my god, that's so funny. There's multiple bodies here. So many bodies. Celevis puppet, do not touch. Hot weathers, but there's there's no prompts down here though. Oh wait, 
There's so many bodies that we can possibly use. But... What does that mean? <gasps> yes! We transplant the primal glintstone? Let's do it! My apprentice. Just how long has it been? Thank you. You've helped me fill a new body once again. And it's truly a gem. Young and full of vigor, a snug fit for my primal glimstone. Better still, I've shed those awful shackles. Finally, I can return to the Academy to expel the Karian royal family and restore the primeval current. My dear apprentice, I owe this all to you. Damn right you do. Why, why you make it so the hidden body was behind two hidden walls? One was a hidden floor? <laughs> what? <laughs> Finally, I can return to the Academy to expel the Karian royal family and restore the primeval current. Okay, so are we about to witness some shit go down at the Karian school? Damn. I guess we were supposed to res Sullivan too, maybe. Or Sullivan. Hmm, that's the end of the dialogue here, okay. Now I'm invested. My apprentice, as thanks for procuring this new form, I'll be holding you to a higher standard. Nice. Now we can buy sorceries again. <laughs> Not that... Well, we found a really stronger version of all these anyway. Yeah, we, we got a much stronger crystal barrage. Scholar's armament's kind of cool, though, to be honest. But our weapon scales off int anyway. I don't think we can. I don't think you can buff, a like a magic, damaging weapon, right? We can test to find out, but I don't think so. Anything else you got to say? You wished have I not been strict. All right. That's interesting. That is some heavy lore right there. Okay, let's go and first see if we can buff our sword. Side note, carry in school maybe after? Or we can go check, hang on, I just wanna see something. I bring up a fair point, what's going on with the old place? Anything going on here? No. What if we can buff our already high damaging sword? Let's find that out, where is the memorize spell? Um, 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 um. We could also we could make it invisible, maybe. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Okay, we do have a staff. Where's our little staff? No, you cannot. Can you buff any of the special weapons? I guess it's just like Dark Souls 3. But what about my halberd that has coal on it? Nope. Okay, so if you have it elementally infused, it doesn't seem to be able to buff it. Same as Dark Souls 3. Okay. Good to know, good to know. Um, okay. Yeah, we could look for more illusory walls. Who knows? Some shit going down here, apparently. Uh, wait, if we res the sorcerer in Ronnie's ruins, yeah, would there be more to the Ronnie quest line there? Jeez. Um, we can go back as well. I do lack FP. If not, we can go look at Raya Lucaria. That's true, he did say he was raising puppets. Maybe he's secretly alive. Maybe, the lore thickens. We can give a once over to that downstairs room as well now that we have, now that we know that that's actually where that we were supposed to be. Under the elevator is just the beginning of the tower. Nah, nothing secret here. No Ronnie gifts, no Ronnie gifts. Uh, okay, so let's go to the back into there for a second. We can give the bell bearings. We found a couple of them. Maybe we can buy some cool stuff. True. Can I jump off here? Or is this like a dead end for this? No, we're good. We're good. The problem being now we have to refine. I think I know where the ruins are now. Like where exactly they were. They were like in the middle. 
give the bell bearing. Yeah, I actually wonder if we'll buy from that. It'll probably be a few spells that Syllabus would have taught us as well. And EG. Yeah, we can check EG as well. This is wise. Was it here? Yeah, it was here. So it's the first rune area. There's no grace site down here, but what happens when we leave and come back now? Anything creepy in here that we missed? We just talk My apprentice. Outstand. Okay, now that this is just her sorcery hole. Do you think she'd have like a way marker or something? I'm just gonna put one there. Um Okay, I guess that's it. Is there he Celibus was making puppets? Nothing else of of importance in here. Okay, so let's go to the home base for a second. We haven't been here in a little bit. Time to invest in more FP. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely not the end. There's definitely more to that. see where her what about her body that it was left behind we can check that as well um i just want to go see what we can buy at the merchant now oh offer bell wow we just got three bells damn shop two nope shop one celibus oh he's oh that's where you get the 10 sword arts I'm gonna be real, that's a strong spell. That's that's something you could easily use. Fires massive cold magic. Yeah, there's gonna be some pretty damn cool magic. May as well buy it while we have like a load of stuff, you know? Okay, what about regular purchase? What do we have access to now? Nothing that interesting, honestly. Nothing's changed for the other two. Wait, whoa. Oh, is this always like this? Oh, this is new. This is why. PETA. Pure Arcane Staff. We'll buy that just to have it. Black Leather Shield. Kind of cool. It's got the stars on it, but it doesn't have good absorption, so, you know. Okay. Alright, we're out of here. Yeah, that, yeah, we're definitely going to the academy. I just wanted to like see if there's any extra things left behind, like her, where her body was, just to check it out, you know. Just for my own curiosity. There, there's no under Ronnie's Rise elevator. I don't know what you guys are talking about. That under the her elevator is just the tower. It's, it's nothing. Unless there's like a, another hidden floor there that I don't know about. Like, not just under the elevator, but like down in the ground. Okay, we gotta go this way. So Int is just for intelligent spells and stuff, and Arcane has certain magic that scales off of it. And as well as it, it does bleed. It does like a bunch of other things that we don't know about yet. Probably poison increases and stuff like that. Anything with this excessive dead body? No, okay, so, all right. The only other things we have to check out are EG and then we go to the academy. Whoop. EG is, is his thing gone? Oh no, Road to Manor was, is it? Yeah, I know. It was definitely a weapon. Uh, no. What that we just looked at. Oh, EG's still here, though. Greetings, my... Blaze death. Unthinkable. How could Blythe... How did he break free from his cell? No. More importantly, Blythe became a curse that plagued Lady Rani. Yet, even in madness, gave himself to her. I made a grave misjudgment. And I thought myself a capable war counselor. I'll catch up with you soon enough, Blythe. When I do, I only hope you'll accept my apology. Okay. So he just had that to say about it. 
All right, let's go to the academy, shall we? Hug Fia. We already hugged her. Why would we hug her again? <laughs> she drains my HP <laughs> and gives me a terrible item that is irrelevant. Well, not irrelevant, but it's not the best. I want to see what's going down at the academy, though. That's what I want to see. Do we go on the entrance or let's go look at the entrance first, just in case. Uh, okay. So not there. Let's go look in the Raya Lucaria area or maybe the school library. That's where you'd think you'd see the debate parlor schoolhouse. Another story from Thea. Okay, I guess we can try it. We can just use the item to get rid of any curse she gives us. It's not a big deal. Okay, not here either. Uh, there's actually a progression point from here. That wasn't there before. That's different. There's stuff going on in the, in the castle somewhere somewhere and it's coming from the point that i just warped to <laughs> so it's pointing into the castle or was that i don't know it's it's, it's weird or maybe it was church of cuckoo raya lucaria grand library hmm Our boys were on a mission to find where maybe she's with what's his name the guy that we gave the key to but he's not in the castle he's like beside the castle so we got to go look maybe we'll go look beside the castle really quick let's go look around it oh we actually opened that door that we thought was um uh, I wonder where he is. I know he's around here. We gave him the academy key. We could check for sure by seeing if he's not by the the gate where he stayed beforehand. I'm trying to see where uh, Selen went. She went to the academy for the quest, apparently. So there's more to the quest. Which I'm trying to... 100 here. Um, trying to think. We could, we could warp to where he was just to get a, you know, just to check for sure if he's in that church or not. And then after that, we'll go continue into the, the way area that we're at. Whoop. There is something here, though. That wasn't here before. What the hell? This is new. Um. Okay, this one's a... See, this is somewhere we've never been, wherever this... Whatever this hidden thing is. Alright, we'll just go check the one last room with the debate parlor. And then I think we checked every room. At that point, we'll just continue on a little bit. This is where we fought the wizard dog. Say so his corpse is somewhere near the classroom. Interesting. Okay, well, let's go look. Maybe Selen's near it. Does Blythe betray you? He did attack me. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> okay. I guess we're gonna have to wait to find out on that one. 
That's not him. There is, wait, wait, is there still not a door in here that I've never opened? Hold up. I'm pretty sure there is a door to the left over here that we has, have still not opened. Yeah, this thing still has a door. This damn castle. I think we have the key with that thing? Maybe not. Oh, this pot, I forgot. He exists here. Oh, we one-shot him now? Damn, we upgraded. Where is this door? <laughs> it's gotta be somewhere in here. We're on like a mission of like illusory walls. There's definitely one in here then. I'm committed as fuck. At this point... We hit everything until we open a Harry Potter wall. <laughs> yeah, we check in all the bookcases. 100% looking everywhere. Every single one. What a... This hallway. I will break everything. There is tons of bookcases. Where are we going? Let's go over here. This is a wall. Attack that wall. Ooh, wait, there's there's bookshelves there. Attack that wall. Every wall gets a hit. Every wall gets a smack. 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 We go back. We did a full circle. Oh, this one. Smack. 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 <laughs> Smack. 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 <gasps> Everyone's pay off. <laughs> Let's go. You just gotta hit every wall. That's all you have to do. Comet! <laughs> what does Comet do? <laughs> what? Okay, wait. Comet Azer is different than Comet, right? Where's regular Comet? Comet. It's like a weaker Comet Azer. Okay. That was a wall, too. That wasn't even a bookshelf. That was the one one that wasn't a bookshelf, right? We think with our sword and not with our head. Screw our head. <laughs> Sword. <laughs> okay, well, we're in an illusory room. What are the odds there's another illusory thing in the illusory room? What is this? What is this, what is this tactical hole? We're definitely going to be going in there, that's for sure. We're going in that hole. First, we're going to drink, though. I don't care if it kills me. We're checking it. It's a very narrow corridor. One of these is a hidden wall. Never mind, there's a hole. We fall further, further down. <gasps> is this the door? <gasps> this is the door. The door. <laughs> the door. Okay. Graven school talisman. Why are there pots? In? Listen, I just spent an hour hitting doors. You don't want to fuck with this katana. It's, it's ready. Murder. Get out of here. I want to read the talisman. <laughs> Graven school talisman. What do you do? Was that not a talisman? Yes, it was. Raises potency of sorceries. Nice. Nice, okay. That still doesn't tell me where Selen is, but we found something in in our journeys. So the Selen quest line might just progress later on its own. Okay. We might just like she said she was coming here. 
Trying to talk myself out of looking around is basically what I'm doing here. Seems good though. Okay, let's let's go progress the area till we fight a boss. <laughs> We've been side questing for quite some time. We did a lot though. God damn, we got we got a lot done. Let's go to the Forbidden Lands. It's time. It's time. Yeah, maybe. There might be something that triggers her going there, so we'll see. Ooh, though, this area looks so sick. Where am I gonna go? Do you think my lantern would be useful here? Oh, this looks... Does it look better without or with? There's like a giant gold aura leading me. Oh yeah, the map is something you find later on. You can get graces and points and everything without getting the map. The map you find. I mean, this is obviously leading me somewhere. Hey. Oh. There was like such a height dynamic there. It looked kind of weird. I don't know. They look like they have... Okay. The answer is they have Beast Claw. Maybe we get Beast Claw finally. You know, I've been wondering where we get this. That was like in the network test, right? Yeah, it looks kind of more cinematic without that. Let's leave it without the lantern. Even though it says I've unlocked it. No, it doesn't say I've unlocked it. The map will be a point at which you see like a little red lantern. That's how you know where you get the map. You can walk somewhere without getting the map. It doesn't like create the area. It just gives you the detailed area. Oh, we got their armor. That's interesting. What is it called? Vulgar? Maybe not the best place to showcase an armor set in the dark, but... Okay, we're going a little bit weird here. So our, we're supposed to go here to the Grand Lift in general, though. So let's just head towards it, I guess. While also looking for a loot at the same time. Because we are addicted to the loot. Ah, okay. Okay, so you eventually get... Okay, he does give you all the beast miracles. That makes a lot of sense. He gave us beast roar and stuff. Totally makes sense. This place is very, very... Empty. Okay, we found the road that leads to where we're going, though. That guy's tall. That's because that's a horse. That's not just a guy. That's a, that's a knight. Oh, he hit me there. Didn't think so. You dare mess with the moon veil, Katon. Oh, buddy, I'm over here. He doesn't like my magic waves and demise. <laughs> One more should kill his horse. Well, it would have if it would have hit him. Oh, you lucky. You lucky. What am I stuck on a rock? <laughs> I was like trying to run at him. Like, what the hell is happening? Why can't I get there? Okay, thank you. Nice, what did we get for that? A lot of soul. That was like a mini boss. Phantom Slash. Ooh, that kind of sounds like you make like a shadow clone and you just. Phantom Slash skill inspired by the fond remembrances of the Knight's Cavalry creates an, uh, an apparition of the Knight's former instructor who guides a joint lunging upward swing. Additional input allows for a follow up attack. Huh? That's pretty cool. We're gonna test that out when we get to a grace site. That sounds like one of the more interesting area, Ashes of War. 
Oh, we're, we're heading backwards now. On our horse. Yo, thank you, man. Yeah, that was a that was a long quest. We found that sorceress at the beginning of the game. I think in the first stream, yeah. Okay, we are very high. Those are poison boys. That is the rudest trap I've ever seen. I'm backstabbing you. I'm gonna drink the one that gives me regen. Okay. Here. We're getting closer to the actual map? No, not yet. We can kill this for us, I guess. For Yestus. Oh, okay, I didn't think these would work on a rock. Noted. Oh, I see that's still putting in work. <laughs> Alright. This place is definitely interesting. Oh, I can just... Why are these things everywhere? I feel like this area is not like that hard that you would need constant Estus. I think I've only wasted one. <laughs> they keep refilling them. So I'll leave the other ones. What if it's an FP flask? I'd, I'd be down with that. Oh, nice. <laughs> Asking you shall receive. This makes me feel like we're leading to a boss or something. They're giving me so many gifts. And now I even get an extra Estus. What is this? Is this okay? Um, another blue thing. Jeez, man. That's so much. Okay, the, I see the map. I see where the map is now. We go towards that for sure. I see. Well... That's a figure of speech. I don't see, but I'm trying to see. Oh, whoa. Oh, what? You definitely hurt. <laughs> Tactical heals. Finally. Give me that heal. Oh god, we just tanked that. <laughs> no escaping the 2 HP death. Oh my god, that was pretty crazy though. Uh, Gargoyle's Black Axe and Gargoyle's Spear? Black black Blades. So, Strength Faith. And the black version of it is... What was it? Was it an axe? We already had the Black Axe one, so... Must be like a... Oh, there we go. Another Strength Faith. Jeez, all the Gargoyle weapons are Strength Faith. Hey, you guys have some fun weapons on your Strength Faith build if you do that. That's pretty cool. Um, this looks... Is this where we're going? Yeah, this is where we're going. Vision would be appreciated. I think we'll get a grace point. At some point. Oh, 
Oh, the fingers. Oh, this looks like the Dectus lift that we've been to before, but quite obviously it's like the dark version of it, but. Ah, I had the FP heal. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Hey there. You yeah, yeah, you, you can read my fingers. Back. Ahead lies the land of the giant's flame. And the way forth is forbidden. Hear me. The burning of the erd tree is the first cardinal sin. Doing so will unbind destined death and slay the world itself. You don't say. My character looks like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Who would dare put you up to such a task? Most certainly not the fingers. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You. You. <laughs> okay, we level up quick, for sure. Let's do it. What are we leveling? More stam? Finally, more mind, maybe? I don't know. I don't know what level I want to stop at. Maybe we'll stop this character at like 120, 130, just in case. And then we could reallocate them later. And we are doing hefty damage. Our dex is still scaling. Our int is not really... It's not really scaling that much, but... Oh, that is some health. Maybe, you know, okay, we'll do this. When I want to be full int, we can reallocate this one into like Moonlight Greatsword. And we'll then we'll take all the decks we have and throw it into like mind, basically, so we can be a wizard. But right now, we're already too far gone into like a melee class, you know? So we'll just get a little bit more HP. Stamina seems honestly fine. Doesn't give us much. If anything, we'll get like one more stam to be like 110 stam. And then health. That sounds like a plan. Okay. Yeah, I think it'll be higher than 120 as well. We'll see. You know, we'll see about what we do at the end of the playthrough. It's fine. And we could reallocate 11 times, so when we want to go full in for Moonlight Greatsword fun, we can. Yeah, then I get more equip load. Exactly, exactly. I could maybe even take this ring off. Ooh, that'd be nice to get an extra ring slot, but... Okay. Oh, we hoist the medallion. We go in wherever, I guess. We didn't get the map, though. I guess we need to go forward more. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay, we're up above, I guess. So it just like brought us to a different plane. Thank you. Yo, Majin Booty. Always... Thank you, man. I've been loving this game, actually. It's crazy. It's so... It, there's so much to it. I don't even know what to say. It's, it's insane. <laughs> Compared to like any of the other Souls games, this is crazy. Okay, so the map we still have marked. We basically have it marked right here. Okay, let's go this way. Pick up the, uh, the map and then... Mountain tops of the giants. Where are we right now? Okay. Get the map. That's not the map. That's my own ping. The map's up ahead. 
<laughs> I was guided by a blue light that I put there. Yeah, mountaintop of the giants. Let's see what we're looking at here. Okay. So this is the bridge we came up. These tiny little snow path leads to the lift. There we go, the grand lift. And then now we're here, and there's some a lot of stuff to the right of us as well. Okay. Lots of spirits nearby. We're near the Erd tree as well. So many spirits. What the heck? Damn. Did we miss any? No, we don't have an SSC. Yeah, we're good. Cool. Oh, <gasps> finally! I haven't seen you since you warned me of the dragon that I killed. Finally, we meet the tarnished. Who would be Lord? Oh my. Why the long face? I fear that you were previously acquainted with this vessel. Well. Oh, it's not him. That is most unfortunate. For he is dead. As oh, no. for his flesh, he gave it to me. Shabriri. I. Damn, okay. You were about to sacrifice something precious. The life of a fair maiden that you would toss into the fiery forge Whoa. only so that you may be lord what a horrible thing to ponder your ascendancy requires her sacrifice whether she wishes it or not but how would the lord crown so wait be looked upon who we toss it into the fire excuse me chosen tarnished and would be lord Dare to tread the path of true rigor if you are prepared to show resolve and attain lordship through righteous hardship, then heed the words of I, Shabriri. Excuse me, I'm not tossing Melina into the fire. Excuse me. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Shabriri. I don't even remember Shabriri. So sad. Um, wait, is there a boss here, though? Not Melina. I don't care if she wants it. Wait, let's go back. Maybe he has more to say. Yeah, you know, you know what? That was a different line. I was just pondering the sadness of Melina. She must not die. Chosen, tarnished, and descend into the depths far below the Erd Tree capital. Seek audience with the three fingers and the flame of frenzy. If you inherit the flame of frenzy, your flesh will serve as kindling and the girl <gasps> can be spared setting you on the righteous path of lordship the path of the lord of chaos burn the earth tree to the ground and incinerate all that divides and distinguishes ah oh, may chaos take the world May chaos take the world! Yeah! Chosen tarnished. Descend into the depths far below the, the Erd Tree Capital. Below the Erd Tree Capital. Seek audience with the three fingers and the, and the flame, flame of, of frenzy. frenzy. Okay, so we need to go below the... The capital? And find the... Didn't we... Isn't there a triple finger where we did Ronnie's? Didn't we didn't we go there? There was three fingers, right? I thought I know there's three fingers in here. Hold up, let me just warp really quick. That's what he said, yeah. Wasn't it mold? Okay, wait, one sec. Where am I right now? Just so I can warp back. We are basically at the start. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. So, let's go below the capital. That's not below the capital, though.
This is where we definitely saw three fingers. And let me just go here really quick to look in that room. I remember seeing three fingers. I'm not letting her die. Not if I have the power to not let her die. Uh, no, Melina gave, Melina gave us the power to um, level ourselves up. But yeah, below the capital is in the sewers. I guess there's more to the sewers, man. I guess. Okay. Well, right after this, this is just, I want to see, because I know where we picked up the Moonlight Greatsword had like three fingers sitting there. Uh, we can warp down back into the stupid underground area. Fear not the dock, my friend. Below the capital, though, we know we know where that is. We can warp to Morg's boss fight again. See if it has extra for me now. That place was huge, to be honest. So, don't. See. Oh what? Oh wait, yeah. This leads us. Where the hell did we pick up the Moonlight Greatsword? Okay, whatever. This isn't below the capital anyway. This is the capital. So, below the capital, that's like the morgue place, right? I mean, I guess we could go fight a... Oh, wait, I don't know. Maybe maybe going forward, we'll, we'll, we'll do some things and some stuff. How do we get below the capital? Cathedral of the Forsaken? You know what? We could start progressing through Nokron on the underneath as well. There's a lot to the underground area. Let's see. Let's see what else we have, though. There was a lot that we didn't do. We just happened upon a boss fight here. That's the Volcano Manor request for the evil route as well. That's the red market. Yeah, that's for the, the, uh, the story, the quest line. Yeah, we killed the, the dung pie lad. We did. Okay, this is the capital, yeah. Oh! Wait. Oh, there's two different requests. Volcano Manor, Juno, and... The, see, yeah, Vagrum, Vargrum, though. Hmm. But yeah, there's definitely something in the sewers here. Can we warp? Where's the sewer one? Is it underground roadside? No, no, I saw that earlier, sorry. But that's just for the volcano man, that's not really uh, what we're doing right now either. So there's more to the sewers, huh? In the sewers. There is the Dung Eater below as well. That's very true. There's so many things we could do right now, honestly. This is a hidden wall. I like self-sacrifice here. I think it's like, I don't know. Yeah, we did, we did res our wizard pal. She's back. Down the well. Yeah, the, this is where the well leads. In here. Um... I don't know if this actually leads there, though. Did we get a talisman from the spirit? Um, the raises focus one, the horn one. We got a few of the horn ones. And to be honest, though, like before we finish the game, look at all the underside of like Nokram that we haven't done. There's a lot we could do. Like we don't even have the map here. You know what I mean? 
Let's go look underground a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I was trying to find the place that I put the ring on Ronnie. Is that here? Because there's the three fingers there, you know what I mean? There's like a little three finger talisman person thing. Where is that? Oh, you're looking for an item. Oh. Or do you mean the whetstone knives? Spirit Bell? It's called the Moonlight Altar. Is, that, is it not above ground? No, it's, it's below. I, yeah, I don't really see. What the fuck? Yes, it is. <laughs> How very unfortunate. Um, <laughs> yeah, that seemed about right. <laughs> Try and relaunch it and see what happens. Did you find the turtles? Yeah, we did find the turtles. Yes. Those, those turtles, man. Those turtles. There's maintenance, though you said? I guess. We'll see. I mean, I was on the whole time, though. I haven't been kicked off. See you in a second. Seems fine. Okay, yeah, so, wait, yeah. It's in the moonlight area, you're right, I'm dumb. It's up here, it's a um, moonlight altar, yeah. But I guess there could be other fingers in the sewers as well. We didn't find the sewer fingers, so that was weird. Let's just go look here really quick. And if not, I guess we have to venture down into the sewers because they told us that if we find it under the uh, capital, we can save her. Oh yeah, the servers, I guess maybe, I don't know, maybe they forced it like that. Not like I'm summoning, yeah, true. <laughs> not really co-oping anyway, doesn't matter too much. Uh, there's a quest line to get up here. Whoop. Whee! Okay, we can get it. We can also upgrade the Moonlight Great Sword if you guys want to see it. See, look, there's three fingers here. Sort of. I guess this isn't the right altar, though. This is just one of the three finger altars. Alright. I guess I gotta go down into the sewers. I hate the sewers. Ah. Where is the beginning entrance of the sewers? It's like... Underground roadside, maybe? I guess. I guess. It's probably the underground roadside. Oh, David, I see. Hang on one second. I'll look for you. You mean... This talisman restores FP upon defeating enemies. So, like, when you kill enemies? Yeah. I guess it... I wonder if it's more or less than the crit one, though, to be honest. If I'm low on FP, I guess we could do that. But the crit... You can land multiple times, so... Okay, yeah, so here we are. Alright. So there's more to this, I suppose, huh? I mean, we didn't even get that item, so yes, there's a part of this area that we haven't been to. Now the question becomes... 
Where the hell is this? See how much this gives. Oh, it gives less than the crit one. Okay. Crit one is better for that one reason. I'm just trying to clear this up so we can be done and not have to worry about it. Oh, that's explosion. Oh, I didn't see those other two. That was lame. Oh! Why did that not hit me? But okay. I'm not gonna complain. Oh, game. What happened to my crit? That was lame. Catacomb, you see? Okay. The stairs way? We did, didn't we get to go all the way down the stair path or no? Did we stop? No, that led us to the boss. Man, there's so many of these assholes wandering around here. I'm not sitting after we kill these because they're just so annoying. Waste our rest of <laughs> Yeah, there's definitely a lot more to Nokron, but there's a lot more to this sewer as well. Apparently. What? So that's the way we went. We've gone up there. Have we ever gone all the way down the sewer? I don't think we have. Hey, you. Yeah, how did that happen? So sad. Okay, I've never gotten that item, so let's just... Okay. The Deek Artist. Thing. Okay, out of FP. So sad. Smithing stone plus six. It's time for the pipes again. We've gone over here, right? This is where we got the first shortcut. I think. Yeah, this just leads back up to... Yes. Okay, this is the first... The No, this is the last shortcut, actually. What in the... Oh, those do ridiculous damage right now. What the heck? Still more of these damn. God damn. <laughs> We've never been down there with a lobster, so we need to find a way down. I see, I think this is possible. Maybe not. Okay, we need to go down a different way. We have a couple of these behind us. Well, only one made it. I think we can roll down there. If we can get to that secondary pipe right there, we're chilling. Oh, right there. Nice. Let's 
scary down there. Oh, is there a fake wall? Okay, we can go in there as well. But hang on, just let me just, uh... I've never been down here. This has loot. Also has a lobster, which uh, I've never fought before. I don't know how I feel about a lobster. I feel very scared of the lobster. Never mind. I mean, they're okay. They're not so bad. There is a lobster about to throw hands. Yeah, I see that. He's got like 10 of them. Larry, relax. All right, Larry dead. Larry was strong. He was a strong little lobster. Larry the lobster down. Oh no, his cousin Arnold. Why? Why Arnold? Not the item. Not the item. You fuck. You fuck. No. Jesus, what even is that? Homing bubble? Ha! Ah, his lobster claw stuck. How's that feel? I'm, I'm really in his stomach right now. That's scary. Yeah, ouch. Man, what was that about? I'm gonna go heal behind this. Whoa, he had me sorry to been flying backwards. <laughs> Get stunned, damn it. Ooh. Finally. <laughs> Alright. Strip of white flesh. I've been hearing this and I wanted to get it, but I couldn't. <laughs> There's actually a lot of items down here. Okay. Oh, hole in the wall that we've never been to as well. With an elevator. And... Just does. Okay. Hope we can jump there. Later. What is this? Spirits. How does that make sense? How is this lore appropriate? Nice, this is nice. We're getting our FP all the way back. Solid. No. You let me, you let me. Nice. Bring it, knight. Sure, bring it. Thrust at me. No. No. Okay, I can't have my shield up, it seems. It doesn't let you get around to that. Okay. Pretty good. Oh, a lever? Oh, this is a whole other area. I know not what that did. I know what that did. Bro, how many hidden pathways lead back to this? Why are there so many? <laughs> got like eight shortcuts okay you said there's like an illusory wall near the near the pipes huh so we go back to the pipes were they here yes this is the pipe path is it over there that does look like it's leading somewhere random as hell take a look at the moog's shackle you just picked up did i, did I pick up moog's shackle i guess i was paying attention to me fighting um, key item? Maybe? Doesn't... Keys... Moog's shackle. Maybe it's a regular consumable? Normal item, okay. Moog's shackle briefly binds Moog. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so there's an easy way to fight him is what you're telling me right now. Not sure where a fog wall would be. 
Oh, that's to nerf Moog. Ah, okay. Damn, we kind of can't get back now, though, sadly. So, do we jump here? This way, maybe? Oh, really? That might be able to progress this. Hang on. Is it Forsaken Chapel? Cathedral of the Forsaken Chapel? You know, you know. There is some creepy shit going on in here. This is a lot of dead people. Holy shit. Oh dear god, okay. Didn't think that had hyper armor. Dung eaters, a lot of them. Maybe we are going deep, apparently. Is this gold rune? Fit for a oh, well, at this point, like this stream has been me hitting walls, and uh, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Frenzied cookbook. Nice, we can make frenzied things. This looks suspicious. No? Fine. <laughs> Very relaxing music. Shit, we have to parkour onto freaking gravestones, don't we? Fucking dude. Let me just make sure there's no other route here. Did I miss an item, bruh? Did I really? Well. I don't think we can get back up, boys. That's a, that's a missed item. We're gravestone parkouring, I guess. Okay, I like that ledge one. That ledge one's looking nice. Start. Let's see. This side has a lot. That side has death. All right. So we're gonna start here. Oh well, it's gone now. I got the item on the guy. What are you talking about? I'm legally blind. I can see barely. It's too late now. It's too late. I'm already on a tombstone. I need to parkour. Shit. Unless I die, then we can pick it up. <laughs> Fine for the completionists of you. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. <laughs> I'm going. <laughs> To be fair, the lights look like items. They're all whites, goddammit. Look, there's candles everywhere. Shit looking like items. Hey, those are yellow embers, I swear, if that's what I came back for. I'm a boot one of you. <laughs> Fucking lights, dude. Okay, there's one item, but it looks like a candle, okay? Oh my god, I just... <laughs> oh, I took two hits from this guy instead. This is worse. This is worse. <laughs> I blame you all. Where's that stupid second one? Oh, well, there's a... I mean, I know there's a guy there, but he's not attacking. This... No, hell to the no. Hell no. I'm healing off you, what I'm doing. Okay. Now there is one big item. Okay, I'm blind for missing this one. That's fair. 
but it wasn't worth it anyway. I kind of like this guy's symphony, so I don't want to kill him. Legally bland. It's okay, it was literally berries. It was berries, okay? Uh-oh. Oh, thank God, my footing worked out. Yeah, look at these guys. I'm not gonna kill them. I didn't. Is it bad that I was standing beside this guy, and I had no idea he was alive? Just, just throwing that out there. Had z absolutely zero idea that he was alive. This shit is the scariest platforming I've seen. Where am I going now? just fucking death. <laughs> no! Don't tell me that! <laughs> what item are you... <laughs> Whatever, they're berries! I might die here. I'm kind of stuck anyway. I kind of fucked up. I don't think we have a recovery here. Unless we can make that. Listen, if I live, you get you don't get your item. If I if I don't live, well Fate will decide. <laughs> We're getting the item it seems. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> We're getting the item, I guess. <laughs> All right. Where? Where is this item? I've run past three times. I don't understand. Wow. Oh, it's on a platform. Oh, okay. I was looking by the guys. I guess that makes sense. Okay, before I drop onto the gravestone, I will pay attention. Thanks, Fate. They wanted to know what that item was, too. <laughs> I guess. Okay, so is it before I drop here? Because I definitely didn't see an item up there. Must be, like, before I go onto the gravestone, huh? Ah, uh, okay. Stop before the drop. Okay, right before the gravestone. Okay, okay. So this is fine, then. Well, it's not fine, because I hate doing this. This sucks. This is terrifying. <laughs> okay. All right, using vision. <laughs> okay, to be fair, it's literally next to some white goo, a candle, and a fucking torch. Okay, with my type of vision, if it if it's not standing out, it's not getting found. <laughs> this is how it is. Okay, so. Oh no! Wait, where's my souls? Oh god! Not that I care that much, but still. This, this one sucks the most. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god. How did I... Where did I die next? It wasn't here, right? Did I die there? Where am I going? This is the most intricate freaking jumping I've ever seen. Uh, no, I didn't want to land on this one. Ah! <laughs> I'm boned now. Okay, we're good. I want that one. How do I get to that one? Hang on. I'm going to itch my ear. Before we clear. Okay, okay. So I need to jump and hit that pillar. Bruh! <laughs> 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 that one doesn't make sense. <laughs> Maybe rolling? I don't think so, though. I don't think we have the distance for the roll. Maybe the further one. <laughs> this is the worst part of the game I've ever seen. This boss is tough. Yeah, it is, dude. It is tough. Can I just skip my way down like this? 
toughest boss so far. Hang on, let's strategically look down, okay? I could probably... That's some far souls. <laughs> this area sucks. This one especially right here. I gotta like nudge my controller with like the tip of my finger. It's like the worst. Oh my god. I think I did it very strong right there. Okay, what if I jumped there? Maybe that's better. Okay, 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 okay. Right. I think maybe just running would do the trick to that one. Just running or rolling, maybe. Like I don't see rolling working. That's the thing. I really don't see rolling working. But maybe. Maybe there. Is that a jump that's plausible? It might be. But if I go there, where the hell am I going next? Because there's no way. Yeah, if I jump to that one, we can't drop to that one. I think we'll fall if we do that. You think? I don't know. Looking at the top one, do you really think? Well, I think I did jump to that one originally, and then I was like, well, fuck. There's no way we're dropping. We'll die. Okay, we can try to jump to the top one. <laughs> well, it <laughs> turns out all you need to do is miss the top one through sheer effort alone, and then you will be golden. <laughs> That's what I wanted the first time. <laughs> no! 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 How? Why didn't he go forward? Why did he do such a dimpy jump? <laughs> no! <laughs> Why? Why have you betrayed me, parkour? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I bounced off the tip. <laughs> this area. <laughs> no! <laughs> What is right? Like, is there a right path? I don't know, man. Right doesn't look like it's got anywhere to go. It's got one and then death. <laughs> you, I think you have to go left. Damn, that's scary. Okay. 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 This is the last time. I hope. God, that was the scary one. Okay. Wait, is this normal? Did we do this last time? Yes. Let me just walk to this one. Man, I really want to hit that one again, but that was quite the jump. Okay, you think I can hit that and live? Yes! Like, how did I not make that? No! Why did he do it again? Why is he jumping so weak there? Is there something above that platform? I was like hitting my head? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I think I can't jump on that one. There's like something interfering with the jump. <laughs> I'm fucking dead. I'm just running next time. I think you physically can't jump there for some reason. Like what? Why? Every other jump is so fine. Then that jump, he's just like, he does like a half jump. No, I'm actually holding X. I, I noticed that if you half tap X, it does like a half jump. But no, that time I was actually like fully holding X. I don't know. I think I really think that you need to uh, hold X. I mean, no, walk it. 
I'm master at this now. Oh fuck. Oh fuck ball. <laughs> I'm master at this now. <laughs> Yeah, dying to gravity. I sure mastered my skills. I specked into failure. Oh my fuck. <laughs> Alright, this time. We're not gonna think about it. We're just gonna do... We don't think here. We just do... Turns out doing doesn't work either. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, why would they do this to us? Okay, why would they do this? Why would they do this? Why would they do this? <laughs> why would they do this? This is the absolute worst area I've ever seen in a Dark Souls game. By far. Please, save me. Is there like a shortcut? Oh! I was on the ledge. I found a shortcut. <laughs> okay, no, we're not gonna breathe like that. That's how we died last time. Oh god. Oh god. No! I'm so tired of the death. Save me from the gravity. <laughs> All right. All right, here we go. That fucking snicking sound is driving me mad. Okay. All righty. Nice. The zero souls there, they don't matter. Nice. Oh god, oh god, oh god. No, I don't want this. This is the worst. This is the worst one. I want to just get there. Please. Save me, Stan. How do I... How do I make sure? Nice. We just run. We just run, bro. We just do it. Now, this is the thing. What is cucking my jump here? We just run. See? Fuck the jump. The jump sucks. Is this livable? Hang on. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Hallelujah! <laughs> Second hardest boss in the game. This. Wait, how? Excuse me. What? <laughs> they have zero souls. They can just die there. <laughs> How do I get that? How do we get that? What the fuck? <laughs> it's gotta be like a fog wall back there or something. What is this? Oh, yeah, I mean, I'd be able to break it if I could break it, so. Okay, we must have to open that back, like, wall there somehow. Okay. Fire? I like how you think. But I think it won't work. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna... Sadly. Try finger butt hole. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's definitely a hidden wall. 
I mean, one of these there might be a hidden wall. Hold up. Oh, we can try to shoot the wall to see. Yeah, then we'd know. That's a good call. If we can uh, hit the wall. Oh, fuck. Sir. No, you shit! I was doing something. Ah. Uh, no. I think they would have opened it, right? What a troll. What a troll, dude. <laughs> Actually. Okay. These guys are the ones playing the music. Hey, this is livable, right? I didn't forget an item. Other than the one that I physically have no idea how to get. Other wall? The one beside it? Oh, now you got me wanting to try that, but I think I can hit that wall here. Yeah, if that was an Lucy wall, we'd, uh, we'd definitely be hitting it. We must get there somehow. Maybe it's like a not, yeah, a visual glitch. That's possible. Okay. Yo, if I would have just died, so help me <laughs> to gravity. <laughs> oh my god, finally. Well worth it. Well worth it. <laughs> worth. <laughs> oh, talk to Melon. If you intend to claim the frenzied flame, I ask that you cease. It is not to be meddled with. It is chaos, devouring life and thought unending. However ruined this world has become, however mired in torment and despair, life endures. Births continue. There is beauty in that. Is there not? If you would become Lord, do not deny this notion. Please, leave the frenzied flame alone. Are we doing it for you? I ask you, please, as one who strives to become a lord, deny not the lives, the new births of this world. Those who would are not fit to be called lord when the land they preside over is mm. lifeless. Damn, I thought we were doing good by getting this. I thought we were saving her life, you know? Listen to her, brother. Maybe, maybe we should listen to her. It's a bad ending. Does that get her killed if I do that? Okay. Oh, okay. What did we come down here for? <laughs> for you guys to watch me die. <laughs> Is that why? Okay, fine. I guess we go back to the Forbidden Lands. Okay, we're going to look for a boss fight so I can... Uh, end it on a boss fight and get some food and I'll, I'll ponder that i'll ponder which one i want <laughs> you brought me down here to watch me die <laughs> is that why <laughs> okay we'll fight the boss i'll decide by next stream if what ending we're gonna go for i did so much for ronnie though i feel like it'd be cool to see what happens with ronnie <laughs> okay let's just go find somewhere new here to end it on I need some food I'm starving I know but if she, if she gets the fire she dies I know I know I know whatever we'll be able to decide by next stream I'll do some ending researches because I hear music here whoa I want the waifu ending we worked so hard for Ronnie yeah exactly we want waifu ending I don't want the dung eater ending. That doesn't sound good to me. <laughs> Taco Bell. I don't know what I want, but I want food for sure. Oh God, please don't be the hill of all the eagles. Out of all the things I've endured today. Eagles is not what I want. Flight pinion. How is that not a, it should just be flight pigeon. Lead me to a dungeon, sir. 
Yeah, this is one of the cooler areas for sure. I'm losing it to the birds, man. Chase confirms hidden ending dung eater. <laughs> yeah, it exists. I know it does. <laughs> it is cool. <laughs> I'm glad someone caught that. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm getting delirious. Why the birds, though? I'd take trolls over birds. Man, I hear something. Where? Is it flying? Where the fuck is this bug? Or is it just the sound of the snow area? <laughs> that music is still playing. No, it, like, seriously is still playing. All right, Mr. Eagle. Come here, eagle. Whoa. Okay, fine. Nice. There we go. Is it in the tree? Oh, it's in the fucking tree. It's got eagle vision. Pun number two. <laughs> no! Fine. I'll shoot you down with a crossbow, I guess. I gotta make life so difficult on me. Up is not something this can do. Well, this is really fast. <laughs> Beating the shit out of the bug with my fist. Smithing stones. <laughs> okay, you know, that's not terrible. I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah, there are the exploding bug ones. That's true. Where is that leading, by the way? Barely see it. Did we not kill the eagle? Has it returned? I know not how you've returned, eagle, but I will kill you. Okay. There's more this way? Can Torrent jump this? Indeed, but is he meant to jump this? Indeed not. Okay. Butterfly. This area is pretty barren, if I'm being honest. And then I find six enemies. Seven. Okay. Am I having probably something burger related? <laughs> Sounds like a good time. Hello there. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's it's Smo's it's Smo's cousin's cousin. We need you dead. Oh shit, he coming. He coming, coming. I wanna see like Yikes, that is disturbing. How far can it go? I just want to see. That's an interesting whip weapon. It looks like an ultra, like a whip ultra. If that, that exists, I guess. Now it does. That was a sorcery. Damn, you can whip it forward and then pull it back. So you have to dodge it sideways, I guess. That's a good weapon in honesty. It's hard to avoid. Oh shit. He blew his load. Jesus. I'm taking lava damage. He's 
pretty cool. Oh, we got it! Thorned Whip. I kind of figured. Because, like, where else would you get it? It's a dex weapon. Its weapon art is kick. What? Why would its weapon art be kick? I guess because whips are weak to shields. That's an interesting weapon. Uh, 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 where's my katana? There you go. It's pretty cool though. Alright, moving on. Jump. This looks like it's leading to a fight, right? Or watch there be a boss fight on this bridge. Yeah, the, the, you can probably switch the weapon art because kick I don't think is ever locked to anything. So you can put whatever you want on that whip. That's cool because of that, I guess. Can I use my horse here? Okay. Well, after I grab this item. Ashes of War. Yeah, I see the giant archer in the distance. That definitely worries me. That seemed like what we were doing. Use the high frames of getting off the horse. Tactical. That is a big boy. Please don't shoot below your heel and knock me off the cliff. That would be terrible. I'm gonna go over here just in case. on our horsey. Whoop, whoop. Whoop. All right, what are we in at right now? So where we're supposed to go is Volcano Manor request. That's for Volcano Manor though. We can do that though. We're going to. What I really want to find. A grace point or a dungeon? Oh. Honestly, it's pretty barren though for like the snow area. Is there no boss here? Let's see. Is there a way to go to the left? Oh, there's a couple different paths here. Oh, there's a side right there. Hang on. There's a drop down. Oh shit, that's a big beetle. Smithing stone. Okay. Let's check out the side here. Oh, that's rocks. on the other side? Yeah, I'm checking all the corridor, the corners here. Looks dark. Makes me think there's a possible dungeon. Name thy horse. Isn't he just named Torrent? Hmm. I don't see anything under here.
Oh, the special... No, no, you can upgrade uh, this katana one more time. You need something, though. I, I don't have it, but you need something. It shows you in the upgrade slots that it can. Oh, grace point right here, though. We'll decide. Oh, yeah, it's like a dragon stone or dragon. Yeah. Okay, no dungeon there. Let's check this way before we head in. There's a tree over here. Could be another Erd tree boss. That'd be sick. I do need more of those wondrous physics. Ooh. Oh, shit. Okay, I guess it's not here. Merchant up top there, though. Before the bridge? You mean this? Are you calling this a bridge? Like this right here? Or do you mean the giant bridge <laughs> where the guy was shooting me? Hmm. Is this the bridge though? I, I guess you guys are calling that the bridge. Okay. Oh, before the archer bridge, man. I do want to do everything though, so. All right. That's fair. Then we can leave the rest of that for the next day. Dungeon here. Oh, wait, hold up. Yeah, we didn't, wait, what? I don't remember looking through this area at all. We must've been talking. Yeah, I did not go here. As it gets later in the night, my, my vision starts to dwindle. It's lore appropriate. Definitely didn't fight that. That is for sure. That hurts. He was an ever jail boss. I remember him. Oh, that wasted my FP even though I didn't get a flash, unfortunate. Alright, what is around here? But you gave me my flasks back. I would appreciate that. That's awesome. We got... Yeah, there's definitely a lot to this area, damn. Bah! Oh, those things just walk around like enemies? Holy. They're like mini-bosses. Let's do this. Oh, there's actually so many of them. Wow. All these spirits too. Come on, item. The Zammer Ice Storm. Well, finally, some ice magic. I've been wondering if there was any. Seems like there is. There we go, I see the dungeon. I'm going in. But how big is this dungeon? We're literally in a mountain. Oh. That, mount that was the biggest dungeon ever. <laughs> okay. That's fair. <laughs> the timing on that. Oh, this is very different. What is this? That's the lift I came up, Chase. That's what that is. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, horse core. You failed me. I, I want to know if there's anything up there now. Nice. <laughs> 
Okay, that must not have been what you meant. Okay. That wasn't a dungeon, no. That was a that was a an item, but there must be more. There's a lot here actually. This thing is literally leading us to a dungeon here, so where is it pointing? It's just really hard to see with the snow. It's pointing like up to the right of that mountain maybe? I guess? It's gotta be like right near this mountain. Oh, that's a pretty cool spot. You're right, Prometheus. Okay, maybe on the right side of here. Is that where it's pointing? No, it's not. This is where we go on the bridge. Bird. I ain't got time for you right now. Let's check around here. Okay, it's gotta be like, yeah, it, the thing was pointing down. Oh, oh, I think it might be here. Ah, yeah, that makes sense based on the angle that it's pointing. Nice. How much you want to bet there's an ice boss in here? Are those enemies? <laughs> nice. Yeah, right, here we go. The ooh, we're gonna be able to get a miracle after we beat this boss as well. I'm trying to think. Dark Souls three had ashes of Arian Dell. Um, Dark Souls two er, had that snow area. I think they've all had a sort of snow area. That is the biggest one I've seen to date. And he doesn't even get staggered. That's terrifying. Two ways. Well, this one looks like a boss. Bet you there's someone above us though. Yep. Hit me. Hit me. You hit me next. Nice. Wait, did I? Oh, I thought I grabbed both of them at the same time. Yeah, Dark Souls 2 had the Fridge of Scares. Ooh, let's get in here. How many fog wall, I mean illusory walls are gonna be in this dungeon? Find out. Ha! Ah. Wah. Katanas have the worst counter attack. Just purely based on the fact that they miss. Deeper. I mean, I have PTSD when I'm looking down in tiny corridors. Parkour land of death. Oh. I is. Okay, this is obviously where we're going to fight the boss, but we need to find a, a way to dip off and get the lever, I guess. Okay. Ow. That's terrifying. Oh, we're going deeper as well. Jeez. Okay. For ledges I can jump onto. There were none on that one. <laughs> That's funny, Prometheus. Show me the Instagram and see if I do. Oh, pop boy. Pop boy down. Okay. Oh, I killed your parents. I'm sorry. Okay, this seems like the type that would have an illusory wall. Hmm. Maybe... There's obviously a way to get up there. I'm thinking, oh. That's where I came from. No, it's not. <laughs> McLovin, yes. Absolutely. Woo! Can 
need a lamp. Listen. Oh god, I need to not get exploded by pot. That is all I need. Lose your wall. Come on, there's a pathway here in everything. What is this room for? If not for the illusory wall. Yeah, the first elevator had a part I could jump to. I knew I noticed that. Stinkers. Pure stinkers. This is a big, like, dungeon. I could drop, oh, since I could drop down on the left right there, or we're obviously gonna look in here first, and there's Pot Daddy. Okay, that's just for the trap, I guess. Stimulating bolluses. Uh huh. Oh, there we go. We made it. This saw a butterfly. This must lead to the lever. Has to lead to the lever. If not, what am I doing here? I guess it might be that jump off the first elevator that we didn't do. I am loving Elden Ring. I am obsessed, honestly. Wait. Why didn't those do that the first time? Hello. What? Where, what? Didn't they explode? I looked away from the screen for like one second. <laughs> like I, I watched the one explode and then I looked back and we died looked at okay that's pretty crazy when they explode did they not die I gotta rewatch that I didn't see it happen what's alive okay they did, they went nuclear for sure. Damn, okay, wait a second. Is this a fog wall? No. I did want to backtrack, so it's fine. There were a couple places that I was not so sure about. Oh, they exploded, but one delayed and hit you, okay. I was, I literally wasn't looking at the screen when the second explosion went off. That's funny. Oh, okay. I, I understand now. I only thought there was one. Okay, so there was somewhere we could jump here, though. On the first elevator, which means it has to be here. There was nothing else down there. Definitely a place I could jump, right? I remember on the first elevator trip. I'll like ride the other one up, I guess, if we don't see it. Oh. Okay, this is the ledge that I saw. Hmm. Okay, if it's not that. What about beneath? Definitely a, wait, is that a second? Oh, 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 oh. Big brain.
<laughs> this is where it must be. That makes up for all those gravity deaths earlier. A random boss just chilling. Oh, and he does a lot of damage. These things don't tickle. Oh, he's the mage one. Oh, no, not the mage one. The mage one is horrendous. Literally the worst out of all of them. Get the fuck out of here. Whoa! You're terrifying. What in the fuck? <laughs> okay. Things are looking up, sort of. We have a pathway, hidden wall. All right, this looks like it's gonna burn, but it's gonna do the opposite. It's gonna, it's gonna cold burn. Oh, that's a trap. Let's go over here quick. You know what? Something really cold does burn. So, oh, you little shit! I hate these. Deflecting both. Of them. Come here. Come here. All right, we're good. I know I have the cat ring on anymore. Okay. Nothing in here but a bunch of golems. Garbage. Oh, you've got to be joking. What did I get? What did it, the ice hit my toe? Fucking toe ice. Down. No. Fuck. Dead. Not dead. How the hell are we? Oh. What? Is it taunting me? What the fuck? What what is this? I don't I don't get it. You just have to take it, I guess. Oh, I thought I could get greedy with that. <laughs> Oh, that might be. Oh, you bring a valid point. Oh, that could be a illusory wall. Yes. So I saw a boss and I saw ice and I was just like focused on it. There's a chest in here though, so I, oh shit, he's frostbiting me after he died. I don't want the ashes, get that out of here. This would make sense. Yeah. Oh hey. O okay. Who can miss worse? Find out. <laughs> With me apparently. Really? What a what a sweet illusory wall. <laughs> um hmm there's not even a lead like what? Wait. Oh that would have been that would have been great. Missed opportunity right there with this dungeon. Maybe here?
Well then, I'm a little bit lost in terms of where we should be going. I mean, there was just these two cats down here for no reason. Like, what? Why would why would they do that? I guess I got a, a spirit ash. I guess. Hang on. I guess it's that. Why? There's a there's a statue of America there. I guess there's just two of those cat demons. Yeah, I guess we go back to the the pot place. Wait. Oh yeah, no, that makes sense. Wait, no, that doesn't make sense. Hold up, I just wanted to see what there else was down there. The answer is nothing, okay. We gotta go back to the pot area, I guess. There was a lot there still. There definitely is a boss here, though. It's such a big dungeon, there is. No third elevator, though, imagine. I thought I'd check. They control us that way. It'd be pretty hilarious. Uh, I just don't like to waste my FP and have a spirit summon. I'd rather fight myself. Wow, there's even a ledge right there. Shit, do you think we should check that? What are the odds that it has an illusory wall? Pretty high, maybe? We gotta check that. There's no choice. I guess not. Imagine this. Imagine. <laughs> that would be rough. Yeah, under the... We looked ev under everything actually so far. It might be more to the pot area, I guess. No, we didn't... Well, we fought something more than a demigod, I suppose. Or I guess it's a demigod. We fought a demigod. I don't know how many demigods there are. I thought there were five, but we fought a, uh, yeah, we got fought another one, I guess. Just not one that I knew existed. I guess we go up, yeah. <laughs> a god? I don't know what you want to call that. I thought it was like a very main boss, but... Where even did we fight the pot boys? Did we go a little too high? This is the beginning of the dungeon, right? Or is it? No, we found a whole bunch of secret walls. It was down one to the left. Yeah, okay. Let's just sit now that we're not going to be fighting those two boss cats, basically. I'm going to go down one level. And I'll check that ledge that we could jump on there as well. This one has a lot to it. on the way down other than this one that we've done I think we checked here right there's been like two different elevators so I'm a little yeah I did I checked that one okay oh yeah oh boy oh boy oh boy those little pots, man, they do a lot of damage. Yeah, the beast type rivers means there's a boss here that drops a uh, death root. So we're definitely gonna kill the boss here, but we need to find him. And then you can give that death root to the miracle dealer. 
Miracle Dealer. He just basically wants Death Root. Sorry. I don't know why I called it Miracle Dealer, but. Okay. Did we check under this elevator, though? I don't think we did, did we? This doesn't look like it would bring up another one, though, because it's just like a little lift, but. I mean, hell, anything. May as well check it. That's death. Okay, here are the pots. We're literally checking every wall at this point. <laughs> um, this was the big pot. We never got up there, I guess. We've been up on a ledge, but not that one. Okay. Locks on every wall, yeah. Basically me right now. Maybe can we bring, like, ride these up anywhere? seem like it. There was a dungeon that I did that. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. I didn't know they explode if I break them, too. That's terrifying. Okay. No, I know the boss is near the bonfire, but we need to find a lever to open the boss room. I wonder how many more elevators are in here. We checked under all of them so far. Is it in here maybe and we just walked past it? This one's got a lot to it. Oh, we dropped down there, right? Yeah. Definitely have dropped down there before. No, it, it's locked. <laughs> the door is open for you. Um, I that's that's really all there is to the dungeon. What the? Mm. I think there's a ledge on that other elevator where you're just on. Hmm. Find it weird that going down into the cat area didn't have a lever. You know. God, this is definitely the way. They wouldn't bring you down to those cats for no reason. I just jumped off here. Yeah, it's gotta be. I thought that item was here, but this that's not the kit. Isn't what? Isn't this exactly where we just looked and saw that there was an item here? Is that not this place? If that's not this place, then I've never been over there. Like on the one side of the staircase. I thought that was, I dropped down. Yeah, this is where I died, right? But is this not where I came in? If so, then this is the way. Cause I sent this up. This is a different area that looks the same as the other area. What? I'm so confused. That's not the same. Oh, it's not the same area. I sent the elevator up. Why would it be down? This is not the same area. They're identical. This is just a different spot. Ah. Yeah, we've never even been in here. See, look at this. Okay. That looked identical. I'm talking like, I in no way thought that what could impossibly be. Wow, okay. We would have been fine last time then if I'd known that shit. That sucks. Oh shit, except for that hurt.
What, you're gonna drop in the hallway like that? How in the hell do you want me to dodge that? What did I get hit by? Oh. Something throwing some bullshit. What the shit? This thing is not getting staggered like I thought it would. Yeah. All right. I guess we can go under that other elevator. That's the last one we didn't check. Where? Wait, I heard shit. Yeah, let's look under the last elevator. There's nothing else up here? No? Okay. All right, we put it up. This is our last hope. Oh my god, another down. This place is just filled with that. It's like the third area. Screw the pot. I'm grabbing the lever. Where is the lever? Oh my god, it is here. Nice. Oh, I can't attack because of that message. <laughs> nice. Okay, okay. My god. As if there was another moment of that. That's crazy. What's below here though? You think you fall off? I'm gonna only look after we've killed Alex here. There is more below him. Jeez. What in the hell? Wait. No, this is, we've been here. Okay, okay, this is normal. We can just warp back up now. Okay. Right? Yeah. Yeah, this is the death pit one. Yeah, okay, we go, we go warp. No, we can't warp, what? Weird. All right, I guess we go up the normal way. What an adventure this was. Oh. Well, it's kind of late now for the runes. This boss better be something. Or are they there? Are they in that room? Okay, I'm going back down if they're in that room. Yeah, they're in that room. I'm done. All these rooms are blending together for me now. Oh, was it 40,000? Oh, okay. I thought we had like none because we didn't kill any boss. Was it this room here? I think they're up a level. Yeah, eh. I guess I can, is it up here? Oh fuck, good dodge. It's the identical room. Yeah, god damn it. That's so annoying. I'm going, I'm going. Uh, I don't know if I have... Oh, I do have the life sideways ammo, Brody. Yes, we will end with that. Don't worry. That other room that looks identical. What a pain. It's uh, down here. Yeah, there we go. identical rooms okay fucking Jesus those are terrifying because you can't even break them where is the elevator we just went in one giant circle, didn't we? We did. Oh! Oh! What? 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 Does this place just have more and more layers? I've never been there. What the fuck was that? 
Am I in a new place? I've never seen that. What the hell? What the fuck? There's more layers to this than we know, boys. <laughs> Apparently. This has the same drop. I'm fucking confused. Yeah, this one's high as fuck. Look at this. This is different entirely. You all thought I was running circles, but no. I was running correct ways. What the fuck? This place is a maze. <laughs> Inception. <laughs> Am I like gaining a level every time I do this little cycle or something? Like what the fuck? Feels like I'm just going up and down, but I'm not. I'm not just going up and down. Yeah, this is different too, right? Or was this where I dropped? What is going on? This isn't even an elevator room. I'm so confused. I've been here now? Okay. Okay, because I, I fell two levels. Okay. Okay. I know I know where we are. We're good. We're good, yeah. No, this is the uh this is the top level and this is where Pop Boy goes. Alright, yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is where I was. Okay. This makes sense. Yeah, this is where we dropped in the pot. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're good. To be fair, we did find a different part of the dungeon right there. <laughs> <coughs> I am also, I was confused. I was big confused. That is some good design though. What the? Nice. Now we can sit and fight the boss. This is good. Woo! We sit and now the boss the boss is right there. Like we just ran by the boss door. Yeah, if it was a room, it was a, it's not a boss room, but if we missed a room, I believe it. Those all looked the same, to be honest. Okay. There was an opening where you dropped two levels. Um, well, I know where the boss is, so we can go fight the boss, but that means there might be more secrets down there, which I, you know, I believe. <laughs> I'm baked. Fair. I'm not. <laughs> this is still just this confusing. <laughs> okay. We go back down here and the boss should be right in front of us. Alright, dude. This better be one heck of a boss. This place is a, a ridiculous maze. Oh my god. Okay. Better. Oh, oh my, are you serious? I did all that to fight what I fought a billion times. You know how many of these I've killed? And I said this the last time I said you know how many of these I've killed. <laughs> They're still not easy fights though, to be fair. They are weird. I've just gotten the hang of them because I fought like 20. One heck of a boss fight, all right. I guess it, it suits the dungeon. Deja vu, you know? Oh, that was some neck. 
Oh, I didn't think he was gonna do it again. That was weird. Okay. Tail whip. Pick my action. Fap. The prayer. And he probably dies here. Yeah. Nice, and we got a golden seed for it. And the glove wart picker's bearing bell. And a chest. Okay, thank god. I was like, I don't get a weapon for all that trouble. I swear. Better get a weapon. I got a death root. Oh yeah, that's right. Death root. Okay, hang on. Quickly before we call it there, let's go to the beast sanctum and see what exactly we get for our death root. <laughs> Dude, honestly, the dungeon was more complicated than anything. Whoa, he's... Whoa. Whoa! Wait! Whoa! Why? I was giving you death... <clears throat> death root! What? Okay. Well, I wasn't prepared for a fight. This is a little bit rough. Okay. Jesus! You're an aggressive one. What am I putting away? I'm so confused. Okay, let's let's rewarp here and see what the hell happens. Or let's rest and reset. Oh. Over death root, I guess. My thanks, tarnished death. My sin should not be touched by the hand of man. I shall grant thee my cause. Feed me more. All right, Stone of Garonk. I shall feed. Me. Okay, sick. So we got the Beast Claw. <laughs> Too bad we're not a faith build. Um, and yeah, there must be another boss in that dungeon. Okay, we'll we'll pick that up tomorrow though. Mostly because I, I'm starving and need to eat, get some food. <laughs> but let's talk to Melina quick. There is something I'd like to say. But now, oh. I act of my own volition. I have set my heart upon the world that I would have. Regardless of my mother's designs, I won't allow anyone to speak ill of that. Not even you. What were we speaking Shall ill I turn? of? Let my share them with but yeah, let's level up a little bit. Your thoughts. Stam. Your let's ambitions. Get our That's still 46. The principles you would follow. This is better. Okay. And then we'll do some minding after that, I think. All right, that was solid. Although, so we killed another demigod, I guess, but like the one I killed, I didn't know existed, to be honest. Uh, I know I started late today, sadly. I'm gonna start earlier tomorrow, so we could do like another eight hour one tomorrow. I, uh, are we gonna go, okay, you know what? Hang on, hang on, let's go, let's go try and find that one final boss in the dungeon. Are we sure there's a boss there though? Before I commit to that, are we sure? Where even was it? 
that's gonna be tough to navigate but i'm down for it if you guys are down for it <laughs> imagine trying to find that in there oh my god what is this called giants mountaintop catacombs i just want to see if there is one before we go on an adventure and waste time. <laughs> um. There is, huh? I don't really see, although there's not a lot of information on Elden Ring as it is, so. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll save it for tomorrow. I'll look, I'll look to see if there is one more in here before we waste time just running in circles. Um, what is this called? This exact area, just to make sure. They're called the Giant's Mountaintop Catacombs. Yeah, there's not really any info on Elden Ring really right now, so. Yeah. All right, we'll call it there for now, boys. We'll continue tomorrow. I'll look up to see if there is one more in here, and we'll go back into that maze. I am just beat. and need some food. But here is what we're going to end on here. I have that build. We might switch it up. We can go full in maybe next time. Uh, the demigod we fought today was Margot, but, like, a different version. I'm not going to spoil where, but, like, yeah. It was, like, another Margot, if you didn't see. It was a much cooler boss fight, to be honest. It was an awesome stream, though, guys. I will be back tomorrow a little earlier. We started at like 4 today. I'll probably start at like 2.30 or 3 tomorrow. Maybe even a little earlier if I get up earlier. But yeah, I'll see you guys. Let's go see if we can give an Elden Ring raid to anybody. How many people are actually playing Elden Ring right now? We have... Um, uh, oh, I, got, I guess we have Prod playing. Nice. Lost isn't. No one else I know is. Go give a shout out to Prod. You guys know Prod probably. You probably have watched his content if you've watched mine. It was an awesome stream. He's doing some Elden Ring. Go say hello if you want more Elden Ring in your life. I will be back tomorrow and we will continue this mountaintop and the dungeon.